right, so we should be cool. We should be cool. What's going on with all my good people? What's going on with all my good people? We about to start this shit, man. Pill Your Cat Radio Live, full effect. I got one of the co-hosts with me, man. I don't know what's going on with the other co-hosts, man. They, they're over there eating and sleeping right now, man. I got Vice with me, man. Hey, right, man, you know, it's Vice Versa, you feel me? Tidy P.O.K. shit. You know what I'm saying? These other co-hosts is lazy. No, no, the multitask. You feel me? We in this bitch. Talk, talk, talk that lazy shit, man. Hey, so we got a lot of shit we gonna talk about, man. Then summer madness. You know what I'm saying? It's come and gone. We definitely gonna want to break that down. Also, along with summer madness, you know you had the Grand Prix yesterday that went down on Twitch. You know what I'm saying? All the controversy that happened with that particular event. We're going to break all that shit down. You know what I'm saying? Hidden ties. We're going to get into all that, man. Niggas getting niggas out here saying battles is tied. Eh, it's, I don't know, man. We're we going we gonna to talk about all that. I don't know about no damn tied battles, man. I don't know about that. We're going we gonna to talk about it, though. We're going to talk about it, man. So... Let me see. Is the, let me see. Make sure the YouTube is cracked. Oh, come on, float it, nigga. What you trying to do rocket catch, nigga? Yeah, I was supposed to float that shit. I'm over here playing sloppy. I ain't gonna hold you. This nigga here, man. But yeah, we here, man. So what's up, what's up, Vice, man? What's, what's up with the Summer Madness side of the game, man? How'd you feel about it, man? Did you tune in? Did you catch all of that? Yeah, I was tuned in on the big screen, you feel me? Um, I felt like the most shocking battle was Reed versus Nitty. Felt like that was kind of, uh, felt like that was a kind of a, a surpriser, way to wake niggas up, you feel me? So like Reed Dollar stepped his game up uh, massively from his last battle, you feel me? So, um, with that being said, I had edged it over to read. I just kind of like, I don't know, maybe if it was the first watch, but um, I, a lot of people agree with me, too. Um, other than that, what did I see? I saw, uh, I had Calico, I had Calico beating Averb 2-1. Um, I had Gotti beating Clips 2-1. I gave Clips the first, and then um, he going to try and explain away that choke, but that was a, that was a for sure choke. It was ugly too until he started. It was super ugly. I, I thought that nigga was chewing something. I thought he was chewing some shit. I was like, "What is this nigga eating, bro?" That got him niggas fucked really up. been, like, bro. Niggas been on Twitter, bro, the last two days, bro. Really trying to argue me down, trying to tell me that this nigga didn't choke, bro. I'm like, my nigga, he walked around for 20 seconds. The nigga looked like he was choke. trying to find a hidden fucking bar. This nigga was walking around. He, mm, mm. I'm like, that tastes good. Like nigga, starving. I thought that nigga was tasting what he had for lunch or something like. Man. Yeah, yes. but uh, other than that, I mean, real clever bounce back. I mean, I ain't gonna lie. I haven't seen nobody really do that. Um, like walk around the room, especially on the main stage, pointing out shit. I've seen uh, you know niggas freestyle and use people in the audience, but like to use shit on the wall. You know, Cliff is very creative and very articulate with that shit. I thought that was a good way to save the choke, but other than that, it didn't save the round for him. You feel me? May have had he finished that round without the choke and then threw that in at the end, probably would have gave him a little bit more credit. But um, yeah, I gave Gotti that two one, um, pretty clear. But definitely a good clip in that first. I, I think we need to see more of that clips if you plan on battling some more. Um, what else we got? B dot versus T top battle of the night for sure. Um, that's one of them ones that, you know, I ain't gonna sit here and say classic, but man, they got all the ingredients to be one over time. No, it's a classic. You, know you said it right, man. Six minute wheeler here, man. It's a classic, man. Hey, it's all good, man. Yeah, I know. Uh, it's What's all going good, on, man, my bad, Nico? Man, I have family issues. Oh, you all good, brother? You all good, brother? Nah, that still don't give him the right to cut me off during my feedback, man. <laughs> I apologize. I apologize. I apologize. I apologize. Talk to this excited, nigga, man. man. Don't six let him man, off the hook. Six, Talk to that nigga. Six man, six man will off the bench. He came in excited. I get it. I get it, man. I'm you know, trying to make the threes, right man. Now. My bad, man. He started five. They came in shooting from the free throw from the three point line. That's that. That's, <laughs> that's, all the way, that's, all the way that's my nigga. That's my nigga, Lemon Pepper Lou, man. He just came back from Atlantic City, man. Give him a break, man. 
Yeah, I had to get them wins, man. Back out, back in the bubble, you feel me? <laughs> but uh, yeah, man, uh, the beat out in T Top, yeah, that shit was a vintage battle, man. It's got all the elements of what niggas need to be doing. Um, I'm glad that people are more receptive on the main stage to beat out style. I know that's something that he felt like he had to come to grips with, and he, he hasn't compromised, man. He's still been doing his shit, spitting the way he, that, you know, we've been knowing him to spit since he's been in this motherfucker. So um, I really respect him for, like, holding on to that and waiting until niggas, you know, caught up ahead of the time with that type of style. And now niggas is all receptive to it, you feel me? But T-Top, man, I was really surprised, man. I thought T-Top was going to get washed. I ain't going to hold you. Um, but, but great battle. Can't wait to watch that back. Um, but that was one of my favorite battles of the night. K-Shine versus Chess. Um, I think it just showed kind of it was levels. I ain't going to sit here and say Chess got washed. I, I, I mean, you could argue a, a light 30, gentleman's 30. But um, K Shine just did a little bit more. Every man, time, man. I, I feel I feel like K Shine did a little bit more, man. You feel me? Like he brings more than punches, more than angles, more than just you know great performance and you know stage presence. He brings everything, and he does everything on a top tier level. And that's what you get when you call out K Shine, man. You get to the max. You feel me? Like the nigga, uh, I think he said, you know, the hole above the chest. Like, remember that one time I used to smoke cigarettes? Like, that shit is just funny, bro. The nigga is just animated, bro. And I feel like with K Shine, you never know, like, what type of style you're going to get over the years. He's garnered so many different st- types of styles that, you know, he damn near much there Shane Sungin. You feel me? Facts. But. But uh, he makes it look his own, bro. That's the difference with K. Like, I think K just studies the game, knows what people want to hear, knows how they want to hear, knows niggas need to laugh, they need the comedic relief. But he don't get too caught up in that. He still gives you bars. And as to where chess, we're just waiting on the next punch. It's kind of like, you know what I'm saying? It's great. He got great wordplay. Don't get me wrong. That nigga slippery as a motherfucker. But he got to bring a little bit more. I feel like most of the time we watch the chess, he up there struggling not to choke. And it, it's evident. It really shows when he be up there on the main stage against somebody who's above his caliber, um, so to speak, and K-Shine or anybody kind of. Like, I just feel like, you know, the last time I seen Chess really 100% confident and barking all three rounds was against, like, New Jersey twerk. You feel me? Like, that was one of them battles where I felt like he was 100% in his pocket. But just like with Don John to Don, just like K-Shine just outclassed him, bro, every round. So I had that being a light 30, gentleman's 30. Um but Chess has some crazy shit. I just don't think he's all the way comfortable and he's not all the way focused up there. Like, I feel like there's something about watching him that makes me feel like any given minute this nigga looks like he's not he's not going to finish a bar. You feel me? But um, other than that, great battle. Go battle. Um, help me out. Here we are. Who else we have on this motherfucker? Oh, John John versus Ill Will. Um, I had Ill Will beating the uh, uh, – <laughs> I mean, we already talked about the flower shit, bro. I ain't gonna, I ain't gonna delve into that. But like, it's just, man, bro. I, I don't know. Ill will, I guess that's somebody he felt like. Give John John the niggas that's coming up trying to beat him. But seasoned veterans, man, he struggled with them. Last battle I saw, John John really hang bar for bar with somebody on his level, like well, really above his level, but newer was Geechee, you feel me? He was up there hanging with, and that was a Geechee that wasn't 100% ready, like, in his bag that day, you feel me? Um, but I feel like when you give John John, you know, aggressive, up there with him competition, he he just, man, he comes so basic. And it's like, I can see his punches coming from a mile away, and he, it already don't help that he just raps, like, in the default voice. You know, John John don't have a rap voice, you know, which is cool, you know, be you, you know what I'm saying? You don't have that type of aggression and shit. But it's just John John rapping. It's just John rapping. And it's like, man, if you ain't saying no crazy shit, I'm out, bro. <laughs> I'm checking out. This round ain't for me. You feel me? And it was a lot of the flower scheme did it for me. Um, the two lips and the fucking, you know, I think he said some shit about pushing up daffodils. I just was over it, bro. I think I even made a comment like, uh, yeah, man, this nigga John John. If I hear one more flower scheme, I'm 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 over it, bro. I'm done with it. You feel me? Um. Uh, yeah, man, I'm all in it. You feel me? But uh, <laughs> nigga Drix, nigga Drix don't be in here. I really be giving some real good feedback when I watch it all, man. But yeah, uh, I just didn't. I just didn't. I wasn't feeling John John's, you know, basic flow, man. It, it just wasn't enough. 
And I feel like Ill Will came in there snarling, menacing, aggressive, everything you expect out of Ill Will, you feel me? And um, it was worth the wait on his behalf. But as far as John John, you need like 50% more of what you brought. So and how you niggas feel about this nigga John John with his third round angle when he brought out the pictures of everybody, you know what I'm saying? Rest in peace to all the, you know what I'm saying, all the brothers and sisters. But he brought out pictures, you know what I'm saying, in an attempt to try and set up a punch to uh, get on Ill Will. Like, how was y'all feeling about that? Was y'all... Did y'all like that? Was it cool? Was it not cool? Like, uh, I don't no think comment. shit like that is. I always think shit like that is corny if you can't execute it, man. He should have left it at the black black wealth chain, man. That was the last great angle he pulled off. He should have probably left it there. Um, pulling out pictures of deceased and shit, like you know, what I'm saying rest in peace to you know, what I'm saying. But yeah, I, I don't think. I don't think it was enough, and I think that was like just indica- in- indicative of the fact that this nigga didn't he didn't trust his material to be enough to beat this nigga, bro. You needed extra, you know what I'm saying? Which is cool, but like pull that shit off, like like nobody else has done it. Like make it make it a respectable antic. You feel me? It wasn't enough, and, um, and I, it just was uh, distasteful, um, and it made me look like look at him like yeah, you had to put that in your third because you damn well knew you was gonna be in trouble coming into coming out of that second. So and he was pandering, huh? I said. So you think so he I was th- pandering? I I don't think he was pandering, so to speak. I just don't think he had confidence in his material um, to the point where he felt like he didn't need that. And I don't think that was a strong enough like ace up the sleeve for you to want to pull that out in your third round. Your third round, you got to drive something home, something in your first and second rounds that you've been hinting at against this nigga, you need to drive home in your third. And it just was like, uh, it fell flat for me, bro. Flat soda, you feel me? Like, uh, I wasn't fucking with it. I can't eat that. Talk that flat soda shit. Yeah, that shit been on the counter for a couple days, man. I ain't got no fizz. A shockwave talking shit. Yeah, he bugging, man. He ain't shot no invite though. I'm sitting here looking at my home screen. I ain't got no invite from him. And I've been dropped my gamer tag. My mm-hmm. gamer tag on this nigga. You been writing vice? Uh I mean I better have shit. I got a battle this Sunday. <laughs> shit is in the works. I'll put it like that. Right, writing my life away. Man. Yeah, man, you should. You better, you should. I feel like I, I just seen, I don't know if I ran through all the summer madness shit. Hold on. Uh, Ill Will and John John. Uh, oh, 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 yeah, I got to speak on this. Oh, I didn't like the bill. I didn't like the bill collector, collector and Holmesy shit at all. Didn't like it. Wasn't a fan of it. Battle was so awkward. Hated it. Uh, for everybody that you know, what I'm saying, voted Bill Flex through. Yeah, I heard Magic and Fire, Magic and uh, Coffee was fire as well. I still ain't got no invite from this nigga Shockwave, man. This nigga fucking aftershock over here. But yeah, man, um, I didn't like the I didn't like the uh, Holmesy and Bill Collector battle at all. That was a dirty, dirty, thirty from Holmesy to Bill, in my opinion. Um, I don't know what the fuck he was thinking about coming with that material for what was it, twenty five k? Woo. Yeah, that wasn't it. You so like yeah, I'm just breeze through that like battle. Kind of uh, phoned it in, or you feel like you just was it because they had so uh, much uh, shit to know, prep I up, some, or I, I saw some niggas saying. I mean, I here, here's the thing with Bill, man. I don't know what Bill I'm getting anytime I watch that nigga battle against Ryder. I feel like his cadence and the way he was rapping and some of the shit he was saying was uber clever, like. Some like shit that Billy be doing, like Billy be sneaking some crazy shit in, and I like him Billy style the bill collector a lot because he could just in, in, in capture a whole audience with his antics or with his style, and um, I just wasn't catching it, man. I, I don't know what it was. I, I didn't. I wasn't catching it, man. There was nothing in there that was needed to be decoded. It was no next level shit. Like oh, Bill spin. Like it wasn't. I had none of those moments through none of his material. And I just feel like with that opportunity afoot, you got to like, man, maybe it was the prep. I don't know. Maybe Bill Collector couldn't come with no crazy ter- material like that in the time he had. But Holmesy, I mean, he, he I, I feel like that wasn't even the best Holmesy. I feel like Holmesy had better rounds in the tournament than he did in 
Summer Madness. And um, and that's cool. I, I, maybe he played towards Bill Collector's weaknesses and knew he wasn't going to do no crazy, you know, mind-blowing shit. But that battle was just whatever. It, it was I could have smoked on that one and just came back and be like, oh, Holmes, you won 25K? That's what's up. You feel me? And moved on with my life. And that battle but was trash as fuck. Yeah, but I watched it. Um, yeah, man. Rum Diddy and Reed was crazy, man. Now, I feel like that who was one won? of my favorite battles. I want to know who won. I want to see a niggas going to keep it real. Who won? I, I told you already earlier in this uh, in the Discord, I feel like I had Reed first watch, Edge of Him 2-1. And there was other people that was there that fuck with Nitty way more than they fuck with Reed. Like, I'm pretty sure a lot of niggas do. That was calling it down the middle. First watch. Hey, man, this nigga Reed was different, bro. He was fucking different. He was fine. You know what I'm saying? He was. He, he had this tone. Yeah, he was walking the whole. He was moving around the ring like I, I just. I, I like when niggas take advantage of the moment, bro. He was not giving no fucks, bro. He was barking like his voice was menacing. The nigga was growling. The nigga's wordplay was like, man, like he fucking got some beef. Like he got some fucking um, what's that shit called? Like that nigga got some uh, BC or something and just upped everything in his arsenal, like. I don't know, man, but that nigga Reed Dollars was definitely not on uh, default creative player status. That nigga came in there and was fucking spitting, bro. Um, he was and spitting. I respected it. I respected it. I saw the, the reason. The reason I the reason I say that is because, bro, I saw Nitty grinning like, damn, this nigga cooking like mid round. I've never seen Nitty give nobody that. Like, then push the nigga and like was pointing like, okay, nigga, you out here to play today. You, you came outside with it. Like, you came outside equipped. You feel me? So. I just feel like um, when you get that type of respect, bro, from somebody who just walks in, I think Nitty walks in expecting to smoke niggas, bro. Just the way he writes, the level he on, and that's no disrespect to his opponents, but I just feel like, <clears throat> as anybody should, but more so this nigga with the type of skill set he got, um, walked in expecting to like really, really watch Reed Dollars, bro. We all did. I did. I was surprised. I'm like, I can't believe I'm watching this nigga like fight. You know what I'm saying? Like. He wasn't really on the ropes. You feel me? The nigga was really throwing them back and initiating some of the aggression a lot of the time. So, uh, yeah, that was a close one, man. I think niggas will still have to watch it. I think when that shit drop on the app, the reactions and the, and the who people got winning is going to be split. It's going to be damn close. It's just one of those battles, bro. But uh, it comes down to what you like. And I saw somebody say, uh, just because a nigga did better than expected don't mean that he won. And I get that. Like, we ain't about to sit here and be like, oh, he exceeded expectations. But this is still Reed Dollars, bro. Like, we know he can rap, which is why the folklore behind his name is so strong. So it's like, yeah, you can sit there and say that, but better than expected don't mean like this nigga never had the capacity. Better than expected is like, I apply that to niggas that just started and we and they've been choking their whole career and they finally get through three rounds. You feel me? Like, like Jay Boog, you feel me? Better than expected. That's a better than expected type nigga. You know what I'm saying? You can tell him I said that. He's doing better than expected currently because he's not choking. And that's Ooh. not enough. You feel me? Jay Boog. You know, I know. Hidden, somebody dropped a hidden character get, uh, gift down there for me. You feel me? Every time I speak on a hidden character, just drop that motherfucker. But, uh, DJ Boog along, man. Nah, the nigga came barking up my tree, man. I'm about to pull the broomstick out on him and get him off my he shit, just, man. He just ready to fight, man. He just ready to fight, man. Yeah, he gonna be punch drunk fucking yeah, with me. I'll be mentioning some so, of the most hidden motherfuckers that? in the history. Hey, man. This nigga Nico, man. <laughs> that nigga thought y'all was talking about. Nah, know, I don't like, bro. I'm not, I'm not trying to be, like, mean-spirited or nothing. I'm just saying, bro, like... Just be like, bro. I don't be knowing. Hey man, if we, didn't, if, if we didn't bring them up, if we didn't bring them up at all, bro, they would stop battle rapping. So you gotta, you gotta say their name every now and then. It's like Candyman, bro. Like you, you, you don't, you don't like the results of saying their name, but eventually you are gonna say it out of just, just. You gotta mention these niggas every now and then, man. So like, need niggas like him, man. Need niggas like Jay Boog, you know, just you know, lurking around. He gonna get what's coming to him. <clears throat> Who? Oh, J Book. Look, man, I'm just happy. I'm proud of my boy. That's my dog. It's my little nigga, man. I'm proud. Hey, of yeah, man. Fought. He been. Yeah. I'm happy he caught back and fought back because he was counted out. Yeah, man. When you count, when you count, uh, you know, albeit, you know, he fought a Christian battle rapper and a uh, on the decline, De Niro, 
at the bottom of his rope. Yeah, I get it. Yeah, I'm glad he fought back against them two people. He better had. But, like, he, who is he stood in front of that he's fought back against that was really menacing? Like, anybody that posed a threat. You feel me? That's what we got to stop doing. We, that's what we got to stop doing. You feel me? Like, I can say, you know what I'm saying? I'm proud of G-Will, this nigga fighting. Like, because you got in there with Ratchet. You stood in front of me for two rounds. You know what I'm saying? That's pressure. You feel me? But I can't get at I can't really get at the Jay Wood Jay Bird just yet. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, he battling people higher than his tier. Like that's like G Will coming out the gate, <laughs> battling a ratchet who's hungry, who's been on the URL, who beat XP clear on the URL, uh PG circuit, and a nigga like me who's one hundred percent about to be aggressive. I mean, you saying that's not pressure for somebody that's up and coming that hasn't had a real plate in the Western Conference or grassroots, like, yeah, that's a little bit of pressure, bro. It's your opportunity to show that you can fight with these niggas. Like, I've been talking my shit because I can get with niggas like Ratchet or Vice. Like, J-Bug don't ha even have that. J-Bug has a, I beat a De Niro on his, on his bottom leg, and I beat a, a, a J-Fence nigga who, who, who is like, uh, you know, fucking no, school buddies with fucking Saga or some or Sunday out. school, Sunday school buddies with the Saga. And shit, you feel me? Rapping like fucking Run DMC. Like, yeah, man. Yeah, he should have beat them niggas. But don't let that, like, like don't let don't let that, those accolades bump, pump that nigga chest up, though. That's what I'm saying, bro. Like, don't let that nigga get too ahead of himself. Like, you know what I'm saying? Until he get in there with somebody who's really going to apply pressure lyrically, just, like, be in your space and make you really have to rap. You know what I'm saying? He still be looking like a shook chihuahua to me sometimes trying to get them bars out. You feel me? All right, man. We, enough of these hidden characters, bro. We was on Summer Madness, and you niggas just brought a bunch of hidden ass shit to the show. Let's get back to it, I man. Think I, I, I think I gave my full Summer Madness. Hey, look, uh, hey, 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 look, hey, look, man. We, we, we trying to break down the whole thing, though. We ain't him saying just not one person. This nigga G Will over there still eating them lemon pepper wings. Look, what's happening, man? Did B Dot catch a 30 or did T Top get around, man? What's happening? What's that? Oh, now niggas quiet. Niggas quiet. You said the B dot what? I said the B dot. Thirty that nigga or the T top get around. Um, I don't know, man. To me, I felt like T top might have got gentleman's thirty, bro. Like he can be happy that he got edged every round, but like I don't know. I feel like B dot clearly won. I feel like B dot came out the gate winning clear. Um, I didn't. I don't even remember none of B dot uh, T top's first round, uh, and, and then I just think of nah, yeah, this nigga might have edged him every like clear the first, clear the third, and edge the second. That's how I think I remember it, bro. I had beat out with a thirty every round. Closest round of the whole battle was the. Uh, uh, I think it, it had to be the third because I thought the first round was clear. Second round, he T-Top had that trash-ass U2 black angle. That shit was trash. And then third round, I thought his third round was fire. But, nigga, it's levels, man. Nah, oh, it's most definitely nine, levels, nine, 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 man. Second close. You giving him a close round when this nigga was talking about you 2 black? Come, what we doing? The second, nah, I don't know about that. Yeah, the second, yeah, nah, nah, it definitely was the second that was close, bro. Uh, I think, bro, me personally, bro, I had beat out with a 30. I'm pretty sure there was rounds that was. I mean, I had him with a 30, but shit. I'm saying there was some shit in his second that was dope. Like, nah, he had, nah, he definitely had some dope shit in, in his every round. I just feel like T-Top issue, bro, is that he'll throw some light shit in between the fire shit and it'll throw you off because it'll have some fire shit, throw some light shit in there and it'll go back to being like, nah, B dot to me was just consistent. He didn't really throw too much light material out there at all. Everything had something to do with the angle he was going with towards T-Top. Like, he, he was on that nigga helmet the whole battle. Like, I thought that was easily battle of the night. I did call it a classic. But I do have B dot with the gentleman sturdy though, like every round. Every round. You said I'm biased. As much as I tell you niggas you lose, I'm biased. Cut it out. I tell the West they lose more than I tell other niggas they lose, man. <laughs> oh, I forgot all about dominoes, bro. I probably got 
I probably got multiple games that canceled on me. Hitting that shit happened to my shit. Have y'all been on here this whole time? Because I swear it just did some hidden ass shit to my shit. Yeah, you got some hidden internet, nigga. Man, I, I had to turn my phone off and on. It ain't even on the internet. This nigga asked us, is we here? Like, the show just going to cut off because he left. <laughs> no, I thought, I thought y'all got canceled. I remember the, what about the time Nico had made a kick hey, off. Hey, this nigga next beat me to it. That nigga next beat me to it. He got hidden characters in here, man. G Will, what's up, man? Talk to me about uh, what was what, what battle was uh, we was on the beat out in T Top. What what was the other battle though? At Summer Menace, I thought it was close. Clips, Clips and Geechee. Yeah, I guess yeah. Clips and I kind of that kind of felt like that one was clear though. The second and third was clear. Like the first round, I gave Clips, but I don't know. I've been seeing niggas giving Clips that third round, and you motherfuckers need to get the fuck up out the culture, bro. Ain't no goddamn way Clips got I can't that third, it. bro. You I can't, can't remix the stutter for twenty round. seconds, come back and think we forgot that you choked, nigga. No, it don't he had the whole. Shit, he was having the Holy Coast, Nico. My nigga, it looked <laughs> no, like that this, nigga. It looked like this. That nigga, nigga, like hey, this, this, nigga, nigga verb, this, this nigga verb, this nigga verb, bro. This nigga verb, <laughs> this nigga <laughs> verb is, is 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 too spicy for my liking, bro. Like, like that shit pissed me off, man. This nigga said he looked like he had paws. He was dealing with a sex demon. Oh, you remember that? You, I put this video up a couple nah, weeks ago too. It's funny. Nah, that nigga nah, said he was nah, dealing with a sex out, bro, demon. Pause, that bro. nigga verb is fucking spicy, man. I swear to God, man. I gotta yeah, find that clip, nigga. That's exactly what the clips look like, though. Clips look like, like a female in that clip. Clips look like an out of shape nigga stupid, working out, man. bro. He just looked like he was dead. He ain't had no energy to keep continuing, bro. It was fire. That was a fire battle, though. I mean, I mean up until the choke shit, yeah. It was a good battle. I ain't gonna lie. It was it was a good battle. Now, <laughs> now what was not a good battle, and I'm gonna keep this all the way one thousand. Um, Calico thirty verb. I don't want to. I don't care what nobody thirty I just verb. He fuck verb up. I just said that. I, Three I was Calico. twelve when I found out sandwich bag that was, was for sandwiches. Ah, ah. Uh, and you got good sense. Talk to him, Cal. Talk that hey, good I sense like, shit. I, bro, I, oh the good sense sit blocks. Yeah, niggas don't know about those. No, niggas do know about those. As a matter of fact, everybody had those in the house. But um, oh shit, I paused it. No, nah, that nigga, that nigga. I feel like we've been waiting for Calico to rap like that for a minute. I feel like I've been waiting to hear Calico talk that shit like that for a minute. Good to yeah, see him man, back in the mix. Cal, Cal, Cal was cooking that nigga, bro. Like he, it, yeah, I'm he telling was. you, bro. The first two rounds from Calico, I felt like that was like the best rounds of the whole battle. The first two, um, I like his third as well. I gave him a third and an edge. I think Verb best round was his third. Verb, like he be doing this rapidy rap yeah, shit, bro, with no fucking directness, bro. Like it just be rapping and rhyming, like it just be a bunch. To rapping, bro, and it sucks, bro, because I remember Bird with the low fade, man. He was a different nigga, man. Like, I hate who he is right now. It's bro, annoying. Verb, when he first stepped on the scene, bro, that was the nigga I felt was the best battle rapper and battle rapper. That was 10 years ago. I ain't seen that Bird in 10 years. <laughs> bro, I ain't seen that nigga. Yeah, bro. A, I ain't seen that nigga in a hidden decade. That nigga been gone. Hey, we've been chasing that Verb since, man, bro. Since Big Gerald. You said Michigan went 2-0. Oh. Who the other? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Ill Will. Yeah, Ill Will dropped the Ill third. Ill Will. Yeah, town in his bitch. Hey, I ain't going to lie. Ill Will was smoking. John John low key. I ain't going to lie. Even though it was a John good John battle, he was like, cooking him. John John looked like the niggas they be giving him when they when they got to battle him. That's how he looked. Like, usually, he'd, he'd be the one getting niggas looking like they up and coming, like they ain't ready. John John definitely looked like he wasn't ready for no ill will type of smoke no time soon. And yeah, that, that was just that shit was getting very wild, bro. Um I think that's everything. I know Shine, he he was talking to that young man. Like he he really sat that 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 was like that was like a dad talking to his son. Like that's just what it looked like, bro. Like he was just really barking on this nigga, bro. Like for real. He he was really oh, barking man. on him. Shine, pound for pound, Shine probably one of the best. I know some niggas say Shine the best nigga. 
in battle rap, I don't agree. I don't think he's the best, but he he top three though. Hands down, he top three. I ain't mad at it. Okay, Sean. Yeah, hands down, he top three. I wouldn't though. I wouldn't like, disagree with that. He's he's top five for sure. The only thing he's about K Sean though, bro, is when you go back and watch his battles on camera, bro, his material don't be aging good, bro. That it's a lot of fast. Oh, it doesn't. Him, bro. It doesn't. You might go back and find some shit he uh, somebody else said like a couple a couple cards ago. I don't, like this, I don't like this chest right now. I ain't gonna lie. I like Shine with angles. Shine with angles? I think that's yeah. a, the best Shine. Like, that nigga's fire. That version of Shine is fire, but the, the flow he's doing the angles with, the with a little bit of everything. Kind of like, you yeah. I'm not, you know. Yeah, Bill and Home. Yeah, you can argue that that was a decent Shine. It probably had, there was probably better Shines in more recent memory, but that was a good Shine, though. I yeah, nah, he was, nah, was fire versus uh, Chess, man. Chess, Chess to me was good, but I just feel like it wasn't enough. Like, it wasn't. First of all, he wasn't all the way prepped because he kept, like, almost throwing up. He couldn't really get the material out all the way clean. It looked like at, at times it looked like Chess was, like, thinking about what he was about to say next versus just Thank rapping. That's, that's just exactly what I was saying, bro. I don't like that at all, bro. It's... It, it, it never. I, I'm never going to get into what you're talking about, bro. If you always look like you're about to just cough it up, like I just, I just didn't feel like he got in his bag 100 percent at all that battle. But he had moments where it looked like he was going to come out of there swinging, but then it's just like, man, you don't come, bro. You look like you're still trying to figure your shit out, and that's the difference, man. That's really the clear difference. Ooh, this nigga did a good stop, man. Ooh. Yeah, man. But yeah, that was the. I think we yeah we, we went over everything with Summer Madness. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to Caffeine. Shout out to URL. Shout out to everybody out there. I had beat out yeah. with performance of the night. I thought beat out was the best for all all the whole the whole event. I thought beat out was the best out there. Honestly, this is my opinion. Um, who would y'all get performance of the night to though? Y'all y'all got a different uh, pick or was beat out y'all pick? Uh, not beat out. I think he deserved that, man. He he did. Oh wow. No, I think beat out deserved that, bro. Like. I, I mean, who better to give it to than a nigga who had performance of the night? You know what I'm saying? Um, as well, I think he just had all the material that that kind of matches that accolade, bro. Like somebody who brought everything. Besides K Shine, I just don't think the level of uh, creativity for me was up there to like rival what B Dot put out there. I think everybody was just impressed with B Dot's brown like it's material which is concise and that's the type of shit we need more of bro it's just niggas like giving more as far as like what's required in the ring like i feel like b dot understands he has a mission he want to go about he got a brand he got a craft he got niggas to expect certain shit out of him for him to come and give everybody that and just be overall impressing or impressive so to speak um it was it was really it was deserving of him he deserved that shit I can't think of nobody else I would have given to that night, really, to be honest with you. Calico has some solid material. But like I said, I mean, Calico's besides fine. the real nigga talk, um, yeah, man, I got to give it to B-Dot, bro. And he's from the West, too, Reed, man. Like, I, I, see, I see a nigga saying Reed performer tonight. Okay, so y'all, okay, let me ask you oh, a question. You can, make a, you can make a case for Reed. You can make can, a case can, for Reed. You, I, I, I mean, that. can you? Like, was he really better than Ill Will, B-Dot? Calico, like was he really? I thought, he, uh, I thought, than I thought Reed was better than Ill Will. I thought Reed was better than Ill Will. I, uh, better than Ill Will? I, I, I like Reed's material better. Ooh, see, okay, nostalgia. Me is like, yeah, I, nostalgia. See, me, I want to say yes, he was, because I'm a, I was the Reed dollars all the way back in the day. But I'm like, I don't know. Bro. Well, look Ill who he Will had to write really, for, bro. Ill Will was really look fucking who he had up to John write John, for. bro. Like, for real, he was really fucking up John John. Bro. Oh. I don't think I don't think we can say nostalgia when he was writing for Rum Fucking Nitty, bro, on Summer Madness Ten. I, I really, it's who he was writing for. Level of context accounts to this, man. Like we got to really man, give but the John John there, bro. Is, okay, but John John is a more complete battle rapper than Rum Nitty, and John John already smoked. Who you do, oh, if they say you got one, John John or Rum Nitty, who who you think you you would have action at beat? Hold on, I, next. I know you're not quoting that fucking Briz murder move, but I know you're not quoting that trash. Get that, get that shit out of here. That shit was trash. That shit was not good. <laughs> that shit was trash, man. Niggas quoting weak bars, man. That shit was garbage. I had, bro. I'm gonna be honest, man. I thought B dot. I gave it to B dot performer tonight, and I thought like ill will. 
Shine, I ain't gonna lie, Shine though. Shine to me was better than Ill Will. I'll give it to Shine. Shine to me was better than Ill Will. He was that 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 was that was vintage Shine, bro. He really was fucking up chess for all three. Like that might have been the clearest. Nah, well, no, the Holmesy and Bill was, but after that, I think Shine and Chess was probably the clearest margin of victory. Holmesy, Holmesy and Bill was the strong and clearest W. Oh, you had Rum oh. Nitty as a top three performer of the night? Nah, you call me bias next. You better call this nigga conflict bias. You better call this nigga bias. This nigga talking about Rum Nitty top three performer of the night. He lost. Nitty got cooked. What are we doing? Right, I said, okay, what the, what the West in that bias bag this evening? Yeah, he got cooked. Come on, man. Reed, yeah, yeah, conflict. Yeah, yeah. Man, I, I, know, I know you meant Reed. Man, listen, I was trolling Philly, man. That's all I was doing. I, I told Philly what I was doing today, man. Watch out, man. You know what I'm saying? North Philly. <laughs> you know, I, I, I told the niggas I was trolling. Listen, man, if they could do that shit and troll niggas after Reed got clearly smoked by Shine and Surf and they sitting over there trying to find ways to make Reed dollars win, I could do the same thing for the West. But when it come down to it, we know who really won the fucking battle. Nigga, Reed was cooking that nigga. You said I'm terrible at trolling, but everybody went. Hey, everybody went for it. Shit, we went. We have what? Almost two thousand niggas on the uh, with us on the the recap show. Shit, my trolling is doing something. God damn it! It's doing what? something. <laughs> talk to these niggas, nigga. I'll talk to these niggas, man. Hey, man. Talk to numbers, man. Hey, but, out there, but yeah, man, we gonna we gonna move on, man, to the recent events, man. They had to get your ass down. Get your ass down, die. shock. Back there holding that ball in the pocket with Ryan, nigga. I'm gonna smack you. Twitch on the Twitch side of the game. Shout out to Twitch. It was definitely dope. Um, King of the Dot, man. Grand Prix went down. You had Saint versus RX, the Source versus Mad Flex, Active versus Caustic. And then the main event, the battle Ooh, that was the most a good ass controversy. You had disaster versus frat. Ooh. So I'm gonna be honest. I didn't see nothing wrong with what was going on with the judges and the event up until that last battle. And I talked to my brother Kato's, my brother. I even went to bat for my brother. I got, I've, I've been fighting niggas <laughs> off online all I've day on Twitter. I've been going to war with niggas all day. Hey, this nigga Nico been hard at work trying to clear Kato's good day. I've my been mind. trying to go to war for my brother. But I told this nigga, bro, he might have to be on Hidden Character of the Week because that judge decision for a disaster over Frank? What were y'all doing, man. man? They wasn't about to let disaster lose, bro. Come on. They wasn't about well, to hold on, hold on. Nah, 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 nah. Uh, 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 unpack that. What you mean they wasn't going to let him lose? What you mean, Vice? Uh, all conspiracy. right, you want to go ahead and you want to go ahead and name the judges for me, bro? We had R&B, R&B, and Cali shit. He wasn't about, about to let this lose. You had a Next. triune. I mean, he, he a part of, you know what I'm saying, that whole crew, so I understand. If you say that. All right, then. Um, Thank you. K-Dose. K Dose. K Dose. He media. Uh, he felt the pressure. He got pressure. We'll get back to K Dose. He had the nigga L in there, too. He was the other judge. I feel like, bro, I feel like niggas. I don't know. I don't know, man. It, I hate I hate saying, oh, there's some hidden agenda. Or, like, niggas knew who they wanted, but that, you can't really. Like, with the crew school, that was bullshit. Niggas knew who was working, like, and you did have action if you went in there and fucked, caught one of them niggas slipping. Facts. This shit, it was, the West was star-studded, bro. Like, I felt like any of these niggas could have been able to move on. The fact that Frack went fucking hammered and didn't move on, uh, I mean, I'm not saying this was whack or none of that, bro, like, but Frack was Wait, let, me, let, me, let me ask this question. Let me ask this question. Was either, because the first round to me, I gave it to Diz. I did think Diz won the first. But the last two rounds, were either of the last two remotely close, in your opinion? I don't think so. I think Diz fell into what niggas known for, and I was just fucking just rapping, just rap for a minute. I was just like, all right, man. Like, the first was dope, but this shit right here is getting repetitive. It's like I feel like I've heard, and he was a little bit more chill. This was a more laid back, Diz. 
besides like trying to slap the fuck out of uh, that paper the first time around. Um, that paper shit was, was pretty... godly. That paper bro, fucking shit was that godly. That took me through the roof. Bro, that was some nasty shit. I don't think I've ever, like, man, bro, on that stage, knowing your opponent like that, I don't know if you had a fallback bar and what, bro, but that was smart. That was fucking smart. He played right into it to see a vet like this get, like, pretty much finesse. Uh, the shit was fucking, it was fucking amazing, man. That was fucking amazing to see somebody like that. That I had. I mean, I thought Frack was going to do dope. I didn't oh, think okay. he was going to shake. Look, 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 look. We, we West Coast, man. And for anybody listening who's not from the West, we finna politic. I'm finna politic right now. Was the West crowd biased at that King of the Dot Grand Prix? Because I felt like niggas was real quiet when Frack Hoffa was rapping. I'm not going to lie. Frack Hoffa was talking. I ain't hear no reaction like how I felt I should have been hearing reaction. So am I uh -huh. bugging? Am I bugging, West? Am I bugging? Cause I felt it was a little gas, was a little bias, a little bias in there. What? You? Don't, I'm asking. Do you feel like it was bias in uh, that? No, nah, I'm talking about. I'm talking about the man. Nah, they they just worked me on Madden, man. I, I told you, man. You gonna be on that goddamn Madden? You ain't gonna be on the show. Watch. Let's go, Zeke. These niggas trying to steal from us. Oh, right, that's back. why. Oh, that you using the Cowboys is terrible. All right, man. Listen, I see people saying, "Yeah, it was biased." She said, "Frack can get no gas." Now, I'm not saying Frack got gas. I'm saying Diz was getting some gas because there were certain lines that he was saying the material was not that strong to be getting the kind of oohs and ahs and mm, and all that. It wasn't really that strong for real. And I that felt like Frack, mm -hmm. even even when Frack, like he started his second round off with a rebuttal doing the whole Nick Cannon, the Jewish guy shuts down the show and it was mute. And I hear Diz is like, oh, that's trash. And then he gets into his material. That's when the whole angle and the paper shit come out. Yeah, you know I'm saying, but I'm saying the whole round outside of that paper shit. Like I felt like even the shit that he was like to do it, do it. I thought you would uh, listen to math. Like they didn't even cheer. Like I'm like, bro, he's hitting this nigga with bombs, for real. He was yeah, hitting yeah. him with bombs, and it was real quiet in that room. Yeah, I feel like I feel like it was. Yeah, I feel like it was kind of quiet. But uh, that's why it's, it's, it's it, that that battle's uh, that battle's kind of. It's a weird battle to critique, man. I ain't gonna hold you. It's a weird battle to critique for me. I felt some kind of way about it, like the judgment shit, man. I've never seen the Western Conference so lit off of a KOTD battle like that, bro. Like that, like that judge it was. Oh my God, this nigga got me again with John. Oh, I will. I, I, I'm not in the Western Conference, but I'm telling y'all, it's nothing compared to Twitter. Twitter. I'm talking about the battle rap community was about to burn down that fucking Twitch stream, bro. Like, they was really willing to go, like, they was going at it. I'm talking about, I ain't seen blogs that fast uploaded and live videos. And I'm talking about niggas was not, they was not having it, bro. Like, even, and shout out to my guy, Seven Mitchell. You know what I'm saying? Y'all make sure you go ahead and uh, subscribe, T7M Radio. You know what I'm saying? Make sure you subscribe to my guy, Seven Mitchell, Thorough Brother. He interviewed Kato's, man, after the event was over. And they was killing that interview because Kato's, my brother, and I know your explanation because we talked, but that interview, Kato's getting punched on. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I've been seeing all type of shit niggas been punching on Kato's with because Kato's the only one who's really known to the battle rap world outside of the, you know what I'm saying, outside the West. Like, he only the, the only one really known like that. Everybody else is known over here. So he was getting punched on the most. The rest of you judges, you guys kind of got to punch out of it because ain't nobody know you, but. <laughs> <'Cause> <laughs> like, any judges? And, and Triune, Triune actually went on, uh, my guy DME Detroit, shout out to DME. He actually interviewed him last night, and it came out. After the interview was over, they start pulling files. This nigga Triune was holding up signs during the Math Hoffa shit. The Math Hoffa and this shit. He was holding up signs of Math with, the, you know what I'm saying, all the crack city niggas. So it's like, y'all got, I don't know what, what the judge is looking like now. I don't, I don't know what they do going forward. I don't know, I don't know if you keep the same judges because you're going to have to have another judging panel for the next round so I don't know if you keep the same judges do y'all feel like they should keep the same do they need to substitute I mean and then I think are you they substituting gotta, uh, the whole panel the like what we doing 
I think they need to take it to the people and really decide if they want to keep these judges. I see. Um, I, I, I see. It's kind of mixed. They said bring Kato's back. It's going to be going forward. Let's say the source comes out of nowhere and goes. I mean, and goes wild on Diz, bro. Are they going to give it to Diz again? Like. You know what I'm saying? I don't know, man. Those type of questions we got to start asking ourselves. Like, I'm not gonna, are, I'm, are I'm not gonna lie to uh, uh, Drix. I see you saying bring Kato's back, bro. I don't. The culture might not allow that, bro. They are not fucking with Kato's right now, bro. Like at all. Like what? That's it, it's it's like they. I don't know. I don't know if he could judge. Like if he's a judge, bro, he can't say nothing wrong next round. He got to be immaculate. The breakdowns got to be immaculate. Everything got to be on point. Like, for real. Yeah, I'm saying. Um, you said Nico going to L.A. Hey, shout out to uh, my guy, Lesh One. Lesh One, and shout out to Beast Gatlin as well. They both reached out to me, like, two days before and asked me if I could go. And, you know what I'm saying, last minute I couldn't make the trip. But they definitely asked me to be a judge. And I'm not going to lie to y'all. If I was a judge there on Sunday, that shit would have went a lot different because I would have been applying pressure to the other judges. Y'all think Diz and Actor, they would have... No, I would have been applying pressure. Y'all not finna be making me look foolish. I'm not driving all the way from Sacramento to come out here looking foolish. That voting would have been a whole lot different. Them explanations would have been different. The conversations in between battles, oh, niggas, you tighten up, nigga. Nah, uh, uh, you having me? If you have me be a judge, shit getting run different. Shout out to Organic. I seen his stream today. He was breaking down the whole voting um paperwork. I, I fuck with the paperwork, but they relying on the paperwork too much to the point where they wasn't even breaking down the battle from what they seen. They breaking it down from the paper perspective. The paper didn't watch the battle, nigga. You did. I'm seeing niggas staring at the paper. I'm like, bro, you reading a script? Oh no, I don't, uh, uh. I'm judging, bro. It's gonna be. I, I'd be. I would have been the only one because me personally, I had Saint. Obviously, he won his battle pretty clearly. He he won that one. The Source won his battle. Although Mad Flex third round was very fire. I fuck with that third. First two, the Source, the Caustic and Active battle. I'm not gonna lie, that was like a, a store value battle. That that wasn't something that niggas needed to really watch. I'm just being honest. Um, like you you could have went outside and mowed the lawn. You could have went outside and raked leaves. Um, you could have went outside and seen how much smoke was in the sky. Um, I mean for for I mean you could have probably went and watched the hidden character battle. While that shit was going on, it might have found more entertainment. It was just was not a good battle. It was light. Active to me was slightly better, but I it, it it's like I don't care who won that battle. It was whatever. It, 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 it was that a whole crack bunch judge. of Frank gonna come back with a vengeance, nigga. <laughs> yeah, I'm saying so. I, I wasn't impressed with that battle at all. It just was not good. I seen people saying Caustic should have got the decision. I wouldn't have been mad at it because honestly, I. Like, I could see the argument for Caustic, but to me, both of them was just not it. And I, the person I felt that had the most, I can't even say moments, because they wasn't really moments, but the something closest to a moment was active. When he turned up in his rounds, that stood out the most. But I don't feel like either one of them, that, it just was not a good battle. It, it, it wasn't good at all. It, 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 it wasn't. Talk it wasn't aggressive on everybody's shit. Talk that aggression. I like to hear active keeping it consistent. Nigga won't get no breaks. I uh, you know the pocket check and the push that you know, so I, I found it funny. Hey, no, nah, no, nah, but what, what was funny is caustic. He was like, Hey man, don't do that, bro. He said, Man, you know what it is. I, I created this shit. That nigga's like, You're right. <laughs> yeah, you know saying, um, but yeah, you know what I'm saying? That battle is what it is. The Diz and Frack, bro. I'm not gonna lie, bro. After a decision like that, if I was one of the judges. And I seen the other three voted for Diz. It might have made me leave and just drive home early. Like I'm not even gonna lie, that would have that lightweight would have pissed me off in the building for real. Cause it <laughs> it was annoying me watching it on cam. I'm like, bro, how? And there's not really an explanation as to why. Like the explanations wasn't really thorough. It was like, I don't know. It just was not making sense, bro, to me. Like they, I understand in the building energy play a part. Bro. 
Diz is a performer. He, he, he he's a, a show. When you watch Diz in the building, it's a show. It's different than on camera. I get it. It's way better oh, watching Diz God. in the building than on camera. But it just was not. It wasn't it to me, bro. Like them last two rounds. I thought this second round, how he started, was fire. He was cooking. And then, like, the last half of his second drop off. Then his third round, I think it was the second or third, he ended his round poor. Like, it was almost like he choked and just ended the round. Right. So, it wasn't – Frack should have got that decision, bro. I, I, um, I Sad know. day in West – sad day in the Western Conference for sure. We should have We should have got that right. Man, now we look like a um, bunch of fucking, bunch of fucking assholes. All my people in the Western Conference, man, if you in that group, bro, please make a Twitter account. Get on Twitter. I'm telling you, bro, it's, it's it it'd it be popping in the culture. You know what I'm saying? On that side, um, and also it'll be do good for your career as well. Just go ahead and promo on that side. But all in all, man, Grand Prix. I thought it was a good event. Um, Diz and Frack for what it was as a battle. I thought it was a, a good battle, man. You got you got an all time moment out of Frack. It was fire to paper shit. It was definitely fire. Um, I thought Diz was good in spurts. Definitely his first round I thought was good. His, half of his second, the beginning of his second was good, and then kind of just tailed off after that. I thought Frack every round he got better. He had a lot of dope shit that he was doing, a lot of dope angles, approach, and all that. So I think every battle outside of the the, the 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 store value battle, the active and caustic, I think every battle was pretty good. You know the saying? store so, value. He, he will not let that shit go. The um, store value. But yeah, man. So that's uh, who I don't know, bro. Like, uh, I, I I shout out to all the people who was liking the post when I said, let me see. You know, I'm saying how many of y'all actually think I should be a judge? I know that they told me that they. You for into, sure should be a judge, bro. They told me they looking into trying to that. bring me in for the next round. I don't know if they're going to switch the judges, though, because you and now in a tournament, it'd almost be like on some goods, Iron Solomon type shit. Like, you would have to, like, you bring in a new judge, and then who are you taking out? Because if you bring me in there, I don't have affiliations to nobody there at all. So, you... <laughs> You, who are you taking out? Because niggas think that it's biased already. So if you take K-Dos out and put me in there, you still leaving the other people who was voting and didn't really have explanations for why they had somebody winning. The nigga Triune told DME last night, he told him, like, I didn't know who Frack was coming into the battle. They should have gave him somebody else to battle of his caliber because when you bet when you're battling somebody of legendary uh status and you don't knock him out you don't win like bro this ain't boxing my nigga this is not boxing bro i don't know where they were getting that that theory from i don't like that comparison bro like no the champ needs to knock out niggas that are stepping up to the plate yeah that's because I, I, I that, like that because bro. the challenger because the challenger shouldn't even have a fucking horse's chance in beating you. And I'm going to say this Being... right now. I'm not going to, for for, con for confidentiality purposes, I'm not going to say the person's name. But I talked to almost all. The only judge I didn't talk to was Triune. I reached out to the judges, though. I reached out to all of them. I was told niggas didn't even know about Diz's history with King of the Dot. So the third round angle frack took they didn't even give him points for that angle, which is why they felt like Diz won that round. Wow. So, wow. again, like, if you guys are going to have judges in the future, on uh, Lush One, I know this is like last minute, you, you getting the judges together and you got to find people who you, you believe are not. Because how Organic said it, he's like, you don't want anybody affiliated with these groups and these crews and these battlers, but you also don't want somebody who's emotionally invested. You know what I'm saying? Where they can just give you clear, logical, concise analysis after each battle, tell you why they had somebody winning, no bias or anything like that, right? And I feel like at least one of them for sure, clear <laughs> bias. Clear. And I don't feel like that's right. I don't feel like that's right at all. Um, so if they are going to do the same judges... It gonna have to be some type of uh, understanding, bro. Like it's gonna have to be some. Like you gonna have to break it down. And if you can't break it down, like uh, organic said, start having these niggas rated, and they lose points every time they go against um, 
what the majority vote like you you got to start deducting points and rating these niggas after every fucking round like to keep the best possible judges there because i don't feel like that shit right at all that's just not cool i agree i agree i think they should have been taking a point system or something during the battle like to me, bro. Like, I, I fuck with organics, like the, the the judging paperwork that he had, his system. But for me, if I'm judging a battle, bro, I already know in my head how I'm judging it, bro. I'm 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 listening to all the material. I'm giving points and I'm deducting points. You know what I'm saying? I've already got it. I don't. The paper not gonna like. That's just kind of giving you the structure for niggas who don't know how to judge. I know how to judge, bro. I know exactly what I'm listening to and what I'm looking for. Yeah. You know what I'm saying in terms of. Who created separation? Who won each round? Like, the, you know, on the analytical side of the game, bro. Like, I, I, you know, what I'm saying, I'm not. You know, we we watching shit, and we know exactly what we seeing. So, hopefully, I can get it right. Um, I would love to be a judge. Honestly, I would love to be a judge. If I'm able to do that, that'd be dope. I could not make it this weekend. I'm kind of shooting. My, <laughs> I'm, I'm kind of like. I'm lightweight upset because I'm like, man, had I known something like this could possibly happen, I really, um, I really would have went out there anyway and just took the loss and just went out there because this is, the West looked like a shit show. And I've never seen, a like, in no other tournament did no other region, if a nigga was from the East Coast and he did some foolery as a judge, it didn't affect the whole East Coast. It affected that nigga. These judges, they making the West look bad. For real. And that's not cool. Like, niggas is over here thinking that niggas is scared to judge. They scared of active. They scared of Diz. They're scared of Crack City. Niggas is shook. Niggas is getting, like, punked in the background. Like, bro, you guys is making the West look foolish, man. Y'all making this look trash, bro. And I I don't rock with that shit, bro. So... We get the judges right, man. Get a system right. Get niggas, you know what I'm saying, really thorough with this shit, man. So in the future, we don't have them problems, man. Great. I, bro, I, I ain't even, bro, can you say influence them to say frack? I'm going to be honest, bro. I would have, because I'm pretty sure on the sideline, because they was using the paper and taking notes and shit. I, me personally, I probably would have just used the paper and for, in terms of taking notes to write down material. I wouldn't have been writing down like, oh, I took this point. I would have just write, I yeah. been writing down material that stood out. The bars you like. Yeah, so you can quote them and niggas can know you was paying attention. Yeah, like, so like the, that, the, the, the that's, point system, I thought that's like, how it like, should go. Nine round, I don't need all that, bro. I know who won and lost the round, bro. Like, for real. I know who won and lost. I could tell you exactly how good I felt the round was or how weak I felt the round was, how I felt your material, your delivery. I can tell you all of that shit just by watching it and, and listening. Like, I, I'm, I'm observing that. But to me, I definitely would have been telling people, not even just influence them to vote for the battler. I felt one, but I would have at least gave them like ground rules as far as what you need to do as a judge and how you need to be explaining this shit. Like it's, I don't want to sound like Cassidy, but it's a science to the shit, bro. Like it's not even a real, it's just like, you got to understand what you're talking about, bro. Like a nigga who ain't never played basketball, you can't tell me how to fade away, bro. What you going to tell me? Oh, yeah, man. Oh, you know what I'm saying? Just, just, you know, you're using the right stick on the PlayStation. You know what I'm saying? Fade away. Nah, we, you can't, bro. You got to. I need a nigga who actually <laughs> faded away, bro. Who actually done this shit. You can't teach me post moves and you ain't never played. You know what I'm saying? You ain't never played football. You can't tell a corner how to cover a receiver. Like, I, the only thing I would have did was just give them like a layout, like ground rules and groundwork of what that shit's like a foundation almost. Now, whoever y'all pick is who you pick. You got to stand on that shit. So you fuck up, that's on your fault. But at least there would have been some type of structure. I don't feel like that shit was structured. I felt like niggas was just winging it. Niggas was in the moment. They happy. They, the event going. They all family. They all friends. Like, bro, when I go to these events, bro, we all cool. But when the battles start, I'm not looking at you niggas like my homeboy. I don't care if you and my crew. I don't care if we family. I'm looking at you as a nigga battling, and I'm trying to see if you fire or not. And I'm trying to see how good you really was in comparison to the person you battled. All that friendly shit, all that, hey, I'm trying to be cool and please. You know what I'm saying? I, I want, like, bro, I don't care. I want everybody to eat. I want everybody to do good. But I'm not looking at you as the homie when you battle. I'm looking at you as another battle rapper. Because I don't want no bias. I don't want no part of me. If I'm judging a battle and it's demon, nigga, 
versus somebody else, I don't want to feel like, oh, I got to pick next to Drake just because I'm not. Nah, fuck that, bro. I'm going to pick who the fuck I had winning. If it's a new wave nigga battling somebody else, I'm not picking you because you new wave. I'm going to pick who the fuck I had winning. Yeah, you know I'm saying I don't do that. Are these shit, niggas, bro. Nico? I don't do that shit. Now going into a battle, if I'm doing a prediction, I could definitely say, "Oh man, I'm riding with my nigga." But when it comes to the outcome, bro, especially when you're talking about money, you're talking about 50k on the line, bro. You can't be willy nilly with fucking fifty thousand dollars on the line, bro. You can't do that shit, bro. It looked I was bad. It, it, look, it looked horrible. Track, bro. You man. fucking oh, God, with real paper, bro. You talking about life changing paper for some people? Not saying. Every, anybody in the tournament like that's life changing to them but I'm saying 50k for a nigga is a come up for for most people that's a come up fuck yeah yeah I'm saying Man, so, that's, a, that's, that's a plus for anybody like, you're, keep not, it real. You're, not, you're not trying to be nigga putting out hidden fucking explanations my nigga like bro the ties bro Kato's <laughs> bro <laughs> the ties. Hey, that nigga, that nigga wore that tight ass vest too. <laughs> there were so many ties. I'm like, bro, there's no such thing as a tie in a judge battle, bro. There's no such a fucking thing, bro. And I, I the other judge, like R and B, bro. I. <sighs> See, this is the thing, bro. This, this is what it is. This what this is what it is, bro. I'm just gonna keep it real, bro. West Coast, this is what it is with, with a lot of y'all, right? Y'all be league owners, y'all be hosts, so y'all watch a lot of battles. But just because y'all watch a lot of battles, don't mean you got the credentials to judge a motherfucker's battle, bro. Some of y'all is good at watching. You're good at being there, hosting. Making sure everything goes smooth. You're not really built to, like, you don't got it like that to the, some of y'all don't. And it comes out when it's shit like this and you judging battles and it don't make sense. Like, I need niggas to step up their acumen, bro. Step up your awareness. Step up your knowledge, bro. Like, that shit was embarrassing. Acumen. That shit was embarrassing, bro. Like, for real. I'm, I'm being honest, bro. Like, to even have to holler, because I'm over here hollering at niggas all day. Niggas going back and forth with me on Twitter. My media peers reaching out to me like, bro, Nico, what the fuck's going on over there in the West? And I have to break down the politics of the West and try to, like, I'm keeping it real, but at the same time, I'm like, damn, bro, like, I fuck with y'all heavy. But with shit like this, bro, the whole world watching... And you niggas turn into hidden characters the moment you get in front of a camera with a piece of fucking paper? Come on, bro. That's not cool. It's not cool at all, bro. I, I, I didn't like that, bro. I, I didn't like that shit, bro. That, that shit really had me hot, bro, for real. You know what I'm saying? Um, get it off your chest, Nico. I just, I don't, I, I, I'm done with that, bro. Like like I said, bro, I, I was getting on niggas' helmet for slandering my bro Kato's because he thorough. But when it comes to the critique side of the game, you got to get critique for that shit, bro. You have to. Everybody, you're not, you're not above critique, bro. All you guys got to get that work. Everybody has to get that work. And even, okay, Faith, I'm so glad. Faith, thank you, bro. I'm, I'm so glad you posted this just now, bro. I'm about to say this to my phone. Because this is another thing, bro. Let me, let me, let me, let me, let me get right here it is. Let me, let me, let me say this real quick. So I can look at it on my on, on my phone real quick. Cause I, I really want niggas to understand, bro. Like, like look at this, bro. Scoring system. 10-9. You won the round. 10-8 complete blowout or stumble penalty. 10 to a 7 equals a choke penalty. I'ma be honest. Off rip, I feel a way about telling the nigga his round was a 10 or a 9 and he didn't have no fucking 10 or 9 round. A lot, some of them rounds yesterday wasn't more than a four. So I feel a way about having any of you niggas get told you had a 10 or a nine round. Even if I had to tell you, oh, it was between a 10 or a nine, I'm still going to tell you, no, out of 10, your round was like a three. Some of that shit was ass, right? And then they break down what a stumble is. 
They like this is like a cheat sheet for niggas who don't know battle rap. Like I'll give this fucking paper. I get this shit to a nigga who does not know. I don't know what battle rap is, so I need this. I don't. I'm not. I don't, I don't like that shit, bro. Like, you niggas had a paper in front of you. You put the battler name, battler name, what round, a slip up. You see what all this is? This is like telling you. Watch this. It tells you what a stumble is. It tells you what a choke is. It tells you what a slip up is, right? Watch this at the bottom in the fine print. Judges are to use their own judgment to the best of their ability on penalizing artists given the point removal breakdown. This is like if you're teaching a nigga, like a basketball nigga, somebody who don't know about basketball, and you telling them point guard, shooting guard, small forward, power forward, and center. A real hooper, I don't care about no fucking position. Get on the court and figure it out. Just because a nigga 6'10 don't mean he got to play in the paint. And just because a nigga 6'3 don't mean he got to shoot threes all game. This is a cheat sheet for niggas who don't know how to judge. And obviously some of y'all yesterday needed this motherfucker. But because you couldn't articulate your point, the only thing you could say was what was on this piece of fucking paper. Piece of paper? You niggas got to articulate, bro. Why do you have disaster winning the second round? Why? It can't just be I felt he rapped better. What was better about his rapping? What was it? What was the material? You, what were the bars that stood out? Where are the bars at? I can tell you what stood out about, about Frax. Uh, sec, I can tell you what stood out in that round. I can. The paper shit. The Math Hoffa bar. The Eminem stand shit. I can tell you what stood out. Third round. I can tell you what stood out with Frack material. I can't tell you what stood out with fucking disaster shit. That's a fact, bro. When Jalen Rose said that shit on uh, first take years ago, bro, I, I I was standing up applauding, bro. Because as a nigga who hooped coming up, as a nigga who really, you know what I'm saying? And I, I coach basketball now, bro. I don't do that position shit when it comes to basketball. That's for niggas. That's, that's, not, that's for niggas who don't understand the game. Okay, I'm just going to tell you this so you can follow the game. Nigga, I'm six foot seven. Every court I was on, most of the time, I'd be the tallest nigga on the court. I'm not playing fucking center. Nigga, I got better ball skills than all you niggas. Take y'all weak ass, slow ass into the paint and watch a real nigga sit over here on this perimeter and get this shit cracking. Mm. Wow. You know I can shoot threes. I'm not going to sit my ass in the paint the whole time. Now, if we losing and you niggas can't shoot yourself, of course I'm going to get in the paint because I know I got advantages. But uh -huh. in battle rap, bro, if you can't tell me what punchlines did had, what bat, if you can't tell me what schemes he had, if oh. you can't tell me, not if you're not even gonna mention a bar, a scheme, a joke, mention a rhyme pattern, mention his cadence, mention something, the flow, Preach. mention something. These niggas looked at this paper. Paper. Round one. Um, I got I, I got I got a ten for this. Got a um, ten for this. He was really good, and I, I got a, I got I got a nine for frack. Got a nine Round for Round two. Time. Well, I don't do moments, and, and Diz was rapping good. I gave him a ten and a nine, bruh. Like that shit, you said he go play and get on the court. Nah, listen, bro. And I, I coach, I coach high school basketball, bro. I was before COVID fucked it up. But I'm saying, I like they like most kids like come on the team. They don't really know anything about basketball. So obviously, I give them positions. But when they go on the court, bro, if I tell a nigga, hey, you running the one, and then something happened to one of our players who's running the two, and now I need the nigga off the bench to run the one, and you go to the two. I can't have you looking at me like, damn, bro, I don't know what the, I don't know what to do with it. Nah, I, that's why when I tell a motherfucker get on the court, I'm teaching you all five positions. Cause there might be a game where your short ass might need to play the five, cause we ain't got no tall niggas. The tall niggas got knee problems. Tall nigga them fouled out. 
I need you to go ahead and play the five now, nigga. So I'm gonna teach you everything about it. You're gonna be positionless so you can go anywhere that you you know what I'm saying? Now if you well, excel at a particular position, rock out with it. But most right, motherfuckers, if you if you too. if you can play multiple positions, bro, you an asset. LeBron can play any one through five. Easy. One through five. Talk to LeBron shit. Yeah. Some of these niggas can only play one through three. Some of these niggas can only play one and two. Or the one and two shit. Bro, I'm teaching a five six nigga how to play the five, bro. I have a five six nigga who had a thirty five inch vertical, bro. That don't sound like much, bro. But for a high school five, nigga, that's six a lot. Nigga definitely... He was definitely dunking, bro. Definitely. So yeah, he definitely was in there and he was swatting niggas fucking shots out of that fucking paint all the time. Definitely. Not but I'm, the day. But I'm, but I'm, hold on, but I'm, but I'm saying though, bro. Most people coming into the league, bro. If you were a point guard in college, and you didn't have a crazy handle. Or you didn't have like real good vision, you're gonna move to the two eventually. You're like Steve Smith, he came in the league, he wanted to be a point guard. Year and a half, two years in the league, he couldn't play point. He was getting dog. He could not, he couldn't handle it. So he had to play two. You think a nigga didn't learn you, you think a nigga didn't know how to play two guard before? I'm pretty sure he had played one through three coming into the league. He knew what the fuck he was doing. I'm just I'm just using that as Uno an example. Who knows we didn't really have no height. I ain't gonna lie. The tallest nigga on our team, I, I don't, see, I shouldn't be calling the kids niggas, but anyway, tallest nigga on our team, nigga, 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 was like, ugh, talk to these niggas, five eleven, six foot. They were. We didn't really have no tall. We it, we really did have a small line. We really had the Houston Rockets for real. We didn't have nobody tall on our squad for real. This is like the first year I never had somebody tall play on the team for real. That that was crazy. So we definitely was running some Houston Rockets offense for real. But I didn't let the tallest people on the squad. Y'all not off the hook. You better go in there and dominate in the paint. Ain't no kids your age finna be blocking shots and playing Manute Bowl and fucking Hakeem. But you ain't playing no fucking nigga. Uh, what's, what's the nigga out of bio? You ain't playing no niggas like that in high school, bro. You better dominate. Dominate. He said they niggas you coaching. <laughs> yeah, watch, 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 watch your mouth, nigga. Watch your mouth, man. Watch your mouth, man. Watch the mouth. But yeah, man. Shout out. Listen, bro. I I, I don't know. We didn't, we didn't had a interesting little 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 combo. But yeah, man. King of the Die Grand Prix. It was a good event going into that last battle. I even feel like the last battle was pretty good. It was, it was pretty solid. Like I I fuck with it. I think Diz and Frag. You know what I'm saying? It was a pretty, for what it was, but I thought it was pretty good for a tournament battle. I mean, you know what I'm saying? Two minute rounds, what was it? Two minute, 230, however, what little, little short rounds. I thought it was pretty good. But Frack clearly won that battle. He should have advanced. And the judges got to be held accountable for that shit. The court of law. So, you know what I'm saying? That's that event. Shout out to King of the Dot. Now. Is there anything else going on in the culture, man, that niggas that we need to talk about, Vice? Anything else pressing? Are we, we trying to get niggas on the show, man? Uh, oh, no, nah, open the floodgates, man. Open the gate. Open the gate. So. All right, man. So, fuck it, man. Y'all heard enough of me talking. Who was trying to get up on this goddamn show and talk that shit, man? Who got some narratives, man? You know what I'm saying? We we, oh, we opening the show up, man. Anybody trying to get queued up to talk that shit, man, let me know, man. How at me. Drop it up in the chat right now. I'm going to get you niggas up on her. Yo. What's going on next? What's happening? A whole lot of not shit. whole lot of not shit. Fate said queue up. My nigga Fate just came back from Dallas. Imagine you know that. Fate. Fate, what's happening with Fate? You got to unmute the mic. Yeah. Yeah. What up? What up? What up? I cue that nigga Ray man. I'm gonna cue Ray man. <laughs> oh, you said cue Ray man. Oh, that that nigga muted himself. I oh, know he didn't hear. What's happening with my niggas? Oh, you can tell that's a kid. He just first word out his mouth. You can tell that's a kid, boy. Yeah, I, I, I cue that nigga just so I can mute him. <laughs> <laughs> uh, that nigga got to go to sleep. He got Zoom class in the morning, boy. Boy, distance learning. <laughs> hey, 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 man, hey, man, hey, don't, don't, don't clown Zoom, man. My students got to take Zoom classes right now. Man. Zoom, Zoom, Zoom. Uh, that nigga trying to yeah. fuck with 
Sacramento. Yeah, no, nah, he, nah, he was talking crazy about Sacramento. What's going on with y'all, man? What's your, what's your narrative, man? What's happening, man? Talk to me. This nigga Bobby Lee caught a body. The stupidest body I've ever seen in my life. <laughs> How dumb shit. was it? Shit was filthy, bro. This, I they bet $200, and this nigga choked all three rounds, bro. Oh. <laughs> oh, man. That nigga Bobby Lee walked this nigga right to the car and got that money ASAP, bro. That shit was so funny. <laughs> That nigga says, send the card. Bobby Lee says, let's go get it, nigga. ASAP. Run me my money. Run me my nigga, way. My nigga looks so sad. Like like, <laughs> like a kid. Like he was walking his kid. Fuck it. Nigga got in trouble at school. My nigga had his head down. Bobby Lee had his arm over his shit. Yeah, trying to coach the nigga. You could have did that nigga, that nigga, too, some been talking shit for a minute, too. Okay, to filthy shit. Time. Even Kels just start clowning this nigga, bro, because he said he deserve a crucible. Nigga, after the battle, Kels said crucible. <laughs> crucible? Crucible, smoochable. How much was the paper? More. How much was the bet? Oh, they just bet uh, the 200. The pipe. 200. Oh, okay. All right. All right. That's not too bad. Bobby Lee said, yeah, this 200 and all pennies. He was going to dump it on the nigga. <laughs> nigga was the that disrespect. Nigga was That's crazy. What's up, though, man? How, what's up, man? What y'all feeling, man? What's going on in the culture with y'all? Everything good? You know what I'm saying? Shit, I'm yeah, still yeah. battling hidden characters. But me Sadly, too, man. I told you, I told you <laughs> about this shit. Fate just came back from battling a hidden character. Hit it at a hidden time, nigga, in front of a hidden crowd. Bro, <laughs> I, bro, I literally hit this nigga fade up, bro. It's like one thirty in the. I'm like, bro, have y'all battled yet? This is like, nah, we ain't gone. Yeah, I'm like, bro, it's one. Bro, I swear to God, God, I battled at one thirty in the morning, bro, on on life. Oh my God, damn, bro, like shit. Uh, the shit was the worst, bro. I never seen, bro. They literally had fifteen battles on the card, and everybody was there, nigga. Oh, <laughs> nigga, I could vote. I, you already know, like. You, Don't tell me. J Bug coming Don't tell soon. me Drix gave you the light work. Oh. <laughs> That's the same shit that happened with me and Janelle. Y'all battle hella late. Blame, blame Drix. Nah, that was no, no, no. Mmm. Okay. Okay. But the whole time, De Niro was saying he wanted to battle me. I'm like, bro. Bro, that's crazy. They still know. ain't dropped nigga don't know what he battles, had they? So that nigga uh, don't drop it. Only... <laughs> well, crazy. only EK and Finesse, huh? Yeah, the footage look crazy. <laughs> the footage look crazy. I told Black Knight we're going to drop it. I'm just going to reuse that shit. Yeah, reuse all that shit, man. Hey, Ray, man, man what, what's happening, man? You over there sleep already, nigga? Oh uh, shit! I thought I was on mute. What's good? Nigga? <laughs> what up, nigga? Yeah, you should, I, uh, you I, uh, be. I, I just started uh, shooting this uh, little web series with my boy uh, Trey French. You feel me? We uh, we gonna be watching niggas' uh, music videos and shit like that. Uh, talking about current events going down in the culture. You feel me? So if any of y'all got some music videos or some stuff, uh, crack it. Let me know or let Trey know. You feel me? We gonna get y'all on there. I'm only coming on as a guest. <laughs> I need my own. Yeah, we can do that too. Yeah, yeah, we can do that too. Fine. Yeah, we can do all I that. Need, yeah, I need, I need, my, I need, my, I need my own show, man. Attack on hidden characters, man. Let's wait. <laughs> let's wait. Until Attack my on J, hidden let's, characters. Let's wait until my J Book battle though, so I'll get a little bit more promotion. You know what I'm saying? Hey, I, I heard. I heard about another battle. Hey, I heard about another battle you got with a hidden character next. I got a couple of them on the schedule. Yeah, that nigga told me. I said, "Why did you do that?" <laughs> Wait, which one? Like, I really got a couple of them. My nigga, uh, my nigga, Shock. Oh, yeah, Shock. Poor Shock. <laughs> you ain't learn from Jay the Nightwing, bro? Shock. He unmuted, too. Nigga said, I oh, I'm unmuted? Yeah, nigga, I ain't no hidden character. The scale go from who <laughs> to you, nigga. You <laughs> Look, I think you got to come. Nigga. You know you're a hidden character when you got to tell us you're not a hidden character. Uh, not nah, never. Uh, you know you're a hidden character when you got to try to point out other hidden characters, which is what Ray made this. You <laughs> I'm, I'm starting to battle. I'm starting to battle like finally. 
They got next versus another hidden character. <laughs> Hey, hey, a hey, hey, sidebar, shameless plug, man. Y'all make sure eventually y'all go ahead and check out the interview I just did last night with my guy Brandon from uh, Get Your Bars Up Media. I did an interview over there. Niggas, go ahead and check it out. I think that's like part one. We was on there for dumbass long. I don't know how much of that shit he actually. What y'all talking about? Up. Now he was interviewing me. He wanted to ask me about like my my fucking journey with you know how i got in the better up and all that so that's like really like my first time like really doing a real interview like that for real just about me you know what i'm saying normally i go on shows and i'm just that's dope about rap. so y'all share the shit what's that called uh, send me send me send me that call. shit bro you know, so get your bars up get your bars up okay i'm already subscribed to you. hey what the fuck was jay kruger doing bro duck and danny Yo, that's crazy, bro. How you Danny, bro? Like, that's a look for you, my nigga. And it's Rookie versus Vets, vets, vets bro. on Ben. Bro, on Coop ben. is low and I'm high. What are you, Shockwave? Come on now. You he my medium. nigga, too. Don't do not do this. He's medium. Okay, Shockwave. Whatever you say, bro. You my Shockwave nigga, so I'm not going to do this with you. Shockwave, the newest demon. You see, he got the demons in his name. We just ain't announced yeah. it because he hit. Cause he hidden. He the hidden demon. The hidden demon. Y'all are fuck you are fucking rude. You are hidden fucking demon? rude. Oh shit. <laughs> this demon. nigga stupid. He called him a hidden demon, bro. Call the him. hidden demon. You're a hey, fucking Faye. Hey Faye, how the book is going, bro? <laughs> hey, they going, man. She <laughs> I'm about to get I'm about trying to get, get smoked. Nah, you gotta take the J Book battle. Hey, Shia, hell, Shia be in a hole with zero help? You dig me? Come on, nigga. That oh, shit. man, I'm so bad. I have nigga, no crowd. That's nigga. the worst part is that there was really, bro, like at peak, there was 100 people there, bro. Like the crowd was dumb packed. And them niggas just didn't do the right battles at the right time. How did, like, how did my like, nigga Mozzie do against Street Hems? Bro, Mozzie, bro, Mozzie and Street Hems battled at 1 a.m., bro. And Street Hems is from Dallas, and they battled at 1 a.m. The shit was stupid as fuck. That, that, is, is, that nigga Street Hems had a that, fifth dimension scheme that was disgusting to start off the round. Filthy, bro. yeah, out the gate. Mozzie actually choked out the gate, bro. I was sick. Mm -hmm. <laughs> like, yeah, he, yeah he's, I oh, seen him saying he was be better. Hold on, how y'all watch these fucking battles? I'm in the uh, yeah. pay per view group. Oh, okay, okay, yeah. okay. See, hey, I asked street, those niggas what's up with the paper. Me, bro. I first seen Street see. Hems on the uh, Dallas Fort Worth leagues like years back when he first started. So. Go, he was talking yeah, about when that. I, he was talking yeah, when I go back, it'll it'll probably be me and Vert Street Hems if I if I do go back. <laughs> Hey, 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 why was royalty bullying a league owner like that though? Like pushing that nigga all across the stage. That nigga Boy, that little Mexican dude was a league too. owner. That's yeah. tough. Hold on, a royalty that nigga out there? No, no, royalty didn't choke. No, no he was, I said he was bullying the league owner. The, the oh, other nigga, the, the league owner. The league owner, he battled twice though. That's a bro. This nigga got two battles off before I got one. What you mean? I think it's greedy. And you the he league owner, bro? Greedy. Yeah, you the league owner, bro. You ain't supposed to be battling. Attention, you an attention whore. Hey guys, I do mm, this too. Nah, I, I, nah, I did not. I disagree, bro. That's how Aver, you know, what I'm saying, was coming in the game. He was hosting events and battling. But that yeah, Aver ain't never had no league go. Bro, that shit different. I don't know, bro. Because Kevin, 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 you talking about dopeness. You're not talking about fucking. Oh I don't even know this guy's I mean, name. Petey Pablo. Can't throw your hands up. They don't really battle yeah, them all. Take your shirt good. off. Throw it, spin it around your head just like a helicopter face ass. Yo, Drake, right. I'm telling you, bro. You don't know how many times I went up to these niggas, bro. Let me rap. Let me rap right now. I'm on the stage. Let me rap. We rap it, bro. Like, nigga, bro, these niggas was not with it. I don't know what. Like, that was the thing. It was 15 battles on the card, and they take it third. They're taking thirty minute breaks in between battles, nigga. What? what? what no is this, Did they do any battles? Say first card. Oh, that. nigga. What? Oh, they. Oh, they. Oh, they. Oh, they, oh, they, oh, they, oh, they was doing what niggas out here in the West be doing with these thirty ass minute fucking smoke breaks and shit. Yeah. It is scheduled. And who won? Ek or Poppy G? Uh, in the building. In the building. I'm not gonna lie. I feel like Poppy G won in the yeah. building. I don't. I don't think it'd be close to them though. But in the building, I mean, Ek had two minute rounds for show, sure, and Poppy G had four and a half. <laughs> so the shit he wrote way more like double his rounds every round. Um, EK has some shit though. 
Yeah, you can't fuck it. Like the last half of his third, then they can start picking shit out the crowd freestyle. Like, I think, yeah, he wanted, he wanted to swing it in the building a little bit. Because of, like, you know how to pop EG. That nigga had hella gas. Dumbass, super gas. That's the only main event that got off with the whole crowd, to be honest. Like, nigga, Robin Rhymes and C3 was there and did not battle. Why? Are you serious? What? Yes, bro. They were both right there. They, they were both there and did not battle. They did. They did long before they didn't battle, one o'clock in the morning. Too long. Yeah, they did long before one o'clock in the morning. And that's what even Clutch, I'm with Clutch and Nino. Clutch is like, nigga, this is a California niggas with a big on. Nigga, they wait until one o'clock. <laughs> Niggas See, like, yeah, I'm the only time, the only time I ever had a battle late like that was when that all that shit happened at the riot event. Remember when we all battled? I think you battled Mega. That nigga next battled uh, TK. Yeah, yeah, yeah. that's because nigga, it was a bomb threat. Remember? Yeah, it was a bomb threat. Yeah, it was a bomb threat. Was shit was wild as fuck. So y'all ended up battling at like one in the morning. Oh, you talking? Oh yeah, yeah. When forgot me a TK niggas, battle. When I smoked sixty five yeah. boots. Yo, yeah. Nico was yo, damn, we was all on that card. That's crazy. <laughs> no, yeah, me, me and Mega went first. Shockwave was it? You are not that's shit. A, next. I ain't gonna lie, that's a bar. But damn, we was all on that fucking me, fate, next, Ray, mate. We all battled on that fucking car. That's crazy, bro. Me and next battle. When me and next battled hella years ago, we battled at what one? No, it was two thirty, family. <laughs> oh no, no, no! When I battled the nigga King Malcolm, bro, I battled this nigga at like two a.m. It was like one thirty, bro. Two a.m. is late as fuck, bro. I promise you, yeah. yeah. This weekend in Dallas, bro, me, my battle started at 135. And you can see at the beginning of the battle, I'm looking around like, please, bro, is people coming in? Are you serious? All right, that's it. Damn, that's All right, crazy, it's a caffeine. I, that's it's crazy, a caffeine. Yeah, I'm undefeated, you didn't get I'm undefeated any, you didn't when I have a late battle, bro. So I smoke 65 late and I smoke milk. EK's ducking, Drix. No, he's not ducking. EK said he wants to have battle. It's that nigga, EK got 67 battles, bro. That yeah, nigga. It's just a matter of time, man. I'm really got got so many battles. Too. I don't really want to do another battle this year. Uh, EK, EK about to get smoked by Dot, bro. That's about to be. Uh, Fuck no. Be, yes, he is. No, no. no He's no getting way. smoked. I'm gonna let y'all niggas. Yeah. I'm gonna let y'all niggas know what happened. I think. I think. I think Dot's gonna win too. I think Dot's probably gonna win, but I don't know about smoke. Smoke. <laughs> smoke. 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 He didn't smoke. Oh, yeah, Drew, hold on, y'all. You and Saint Battle at damn, it was like midnight for real. Yeah, but Magna, but I ain't gonna lie, bro. That magnitude card, there was so many. That was like thirty. There battles, was so many bet. Yeah, <laughs> that shit, that shit was ridiculous, bro. Like honestly, and and, and then a fade broke out in my shit, so it, we was forty five minutes late for real. Yeah, Nico, the gun dude over here setting off phase in the middle of the battle. It, was, it shit. wasn't even a gun dude. It was, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> I, I'm, I'm be honest, bro. I thought it was because of the Modesto nah, shit I was saying, but I guess Billy or whoever who was over there was uh, getting into it during the battle. Oh no. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie though. I, I always say this to my nigga. I always say this to my nigga Fate though, bro. If I knew Fate was from, cause I thought Fate was from Stockton. So I, if I knew he was really from Modesto, I would have never said that shit to that nigga Sizzle. I thought he was the only nigga. I was that nigga picking was on him for a reason. Me. Damn, <laughs> damn, Nico, you was on this something like that. Do you he was remember Modesto filthy bar I said city. I don't. I don't remember. I don't remember. Like I, I don't remember the actual bar. I, I just. I remember you talking ridiculous. <laughs> like, yeah, I, I, cause, like, cause he was making me mad because he kept talking about like Sacramento, and he wasn't like being disrespectful, but it was just like his energy was like playing me to the left. And then he was like on some like nigga sack, you know what I'm saying, Modesto over something. Like, oh nah, bro, I'm gonna talk to this. <laughs> I'm, I'm like, bro, we in LA, like nigga, we we both out of town, bro. I'm about to talk to you so crazy on some NorCal shit. I'm about to talk to you filthy. But had I known that you was from Modesto, Phil, I would not have done that. I would, I would have reserved that bar. He's lying, Faye. He definitely would have done that shit. I'm not going to lie. No, no, no. I'm, not, I'm being real 100 your face, face, too. No, I'm, I'm not going to lie, though. Ray Bay, if we would have battled when we were supposed to, I was going to do you so filthy with the Fairfield angles, you was going to hate me. <laughs> you were going to hate me. I'm supposed to battle, me. Supposed to battle Ray May in November. Wait, what? Oh, they, didn't. they didn't tell me about this. 
<laughs> they didn't tell me about this. I'm not hitting that. Like, I ain't gonna lie to you, Ray, mate. If you didn't have none of your information about that, that was gonna get dark for you, bro. I was going, I was going there with you for real. You was gonna get the whole. Uh, <laughs> I said, I said, I said, you I was gonna you get were. the whole treatment with that's, that one. I'm not gonna bro, lie to you. I said, I said, that's I said, why. I said, that's why Ray may have not battle nobody from the north yet. He's scared. He's scared. He don't want nobody to smoke him on his angle. Okay. I, no, I, look, look, listen, y'all. I, don't, I, don't, <laughs> see, I, I ain't gonna lie. I don't know if next would go there. The where where I was gonna go. I don't know if next would go there. But me, I'm going there. Like nigga, don't battle me if you don't want me to angle you and talk to you on some shit that we know is we real. I don't care about so. nobody else. We know it's real. I'm talking to you. <laughs> That's tough. Same way I did the nigga Lucky. I talked to this nigga. I'm, I don't care. Nobody else react to this shit. You know yeah. what I'm saying. Yeah, that, 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 yeah. that nigga, that, that nigga, that nigga. Uh, 357 shit? Oh, my God. That nigga, nigga sat Lucky down for a whole year. <laughs> that, that nigga Nath told me. That nigga, <laughs> hey, that nigga Nath told me don't, uh, what he say? He said, don't not try it and get bodied and tell everybody that you wasn't focused on it. So bro, hey, hey, bro, they better make me adjust for that fucking battle, bro. I don't care what he's Wait, so wait, hey, when, when, when are you battling better. Ness and where can I place my bets? October 31st. Con- pull conf- up. Conflict, you know how I do, bro. I angle every, everybody get an angle, bro. Everybody get talked to, bro. Filthy. I wouldn't hey, do that no bro, more. Listen, though. If I battle right hey, now, listen, bro, I wouldn't I know, do that no more. I just rap. Where that nigga Eon at, bro? I know they like to bet on their homies and shit. I got money. <laughs> I think that's might be who I'm betting. I don't know who I'm betting. I know. I know hey, listen. I you want you want to get easy money? Bet anytime when a rubber ducky rust homies battling, you bet that nigga rubber because you feel me. He'll give you the money for sure, for sure. And he that nigga boy, he'll never learn his lesson. Me and Neff better betting uh three fifty on a Bro, one round five on? minutes. Why is he, okay? Easy. You betting three? Why is he he acting like y'all betting like two thousand? Why is he tripping on niggas judging? Like nigga, I'm the most thorough nigga over here. You gonna have judge your fucking battle? You gonna have a nah, nigga nah, who don't know nah, nothing nah, about nah, battle nah, rap nah, judge your shit? You gonna fucking nah, lose? Trust me, it don't it don't even matter who judges. I got they gonna 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 they so he's not going to sack. Oh, he got a different battle. That's tough. Hey, nah, 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 Nico. Character, bro. Hey, Nico. That nigga Neff think you finna uh, disaster and frack him. Bro, bro, right I, bro, do you, bro, do you, bro, do you understand? I really don't. To, 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 to say I don't give a fuck, bro, it's like I do not give a flying fuck who wins a battle. Bro. I don't. I will. I'm the type of nigga, bro. bro you I know would, that. Hey, no, Nico. I know that. But you feel me? I'm just saying that's probably what that nigga think. Because, because this, this is my thing, bro. A nigga who care about, like, if you, like, if, I, if a nigga's judging and they be like, oh, well, I care about whether this person wins or not. You you scared of what this motherfucker might do to you if you tell him you lost. I'm not scared of shit. Run up on me. We all in Sacramento. That conversation's not going to go too far. If you think I'm a cheating nigga out of some paper, we all in the same city. The fuck? That nigga going to have next losing. That nigga next going to be hot as shit. <laughs> This nigga next gonna get and this nigga go next gonna get all them fruit ridge niggas gonna pull up on me in the Uber. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Niggas not getting that money I lose. I definitely I definitely wanna place bets on that battle right there. Ain't no way I could lose though. Like I said, bro, I haven't even watched enough rap. I watched a little clip from his <laughs> that okay, nigga so just said right a major look conflict. Okay, I, I heard that. There we go. I, I just watched this clip from the boss battle and that shit was terrible. The nigga's not good. I'm not gonna lie, conflict. I, I want you to get. I, I want you. I want you to go to I battle conflict. Find a way to get a battle on I battle. I want to get you in front of Lex because I feel like your style and your pen would go. It'll be well received over there in front of that crowd. Yeah, I'm that hey, Faye, did you I smoke battle. that nigga, bro? I'm pretty. Yeah, sure. I battled Nev on, on a GZ. Yeah, uh, in February. Conceded. Conceded? Who? You talking about Neff? Oh. Neff? He ain't never battled no... F- 
That nigga just said. Oh, that jungle? nigga said Jeff. Who is in Jeff? the jungle? Yeah. You know what? He might have. You know what? About like a I feel like I might have seen that. Hold on, 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 hold on. Hold on. Is this? Is this? The, like hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Is this the super oh, hidden character that conceded battle? Because I do remember conceded battle on a super hidden character. I mean, super duper hidden. Like character. we we talk about like the same time surf battle bricks. No, nah, he got a battle hosted by Conceited. He battled Keith Brown. Yeah, he battled Keith. Yeah, I'm Keith like, Brown. bro, he did not battle no fucking Conceited, bro. Hell no. Yeah, he battled no. fucking Hidden like, Brown. Hey, how, do you say, hey, how do you say his name? Jeff. 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 Hey, 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 sidebar, this nigga Conceited really do average the most views per battle out of all the battlers, bro. I thought it was Surf. Nah, Surf is like number two. He behind Kai, right behind him. Like, they both, they both pretty much at like two million. They both pretty much at two million apiece. That's a million apiece. That's crazy. Man, I got some shit. I got some shit for the boy. I already started riding too. That's how I know it's gonna get ugly. But see, like, that bro, I, 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 I fuck with like. See, the issue with these niggas, bro, that come from like the jungle and all that. And I said the same thing with After. And I think After, to me personally, After better on beat than he is battling. But I think he's solid battling. I think he cool battling. But the problem with a lot of niggas who come from the jungle and grind time, they don't understand material of today. So they think the shit that they saying is crazy, but it's not up to date enough. For today's fucking era. And they still stuck in that shit. Like, the shit he rapped in Monterey, I'm like, bro, that would have been cool six years ago. Yeah, you know. That's not cool right now, bro. But the thing is, uh, what's the what's the leak? It's a nice pen. What is the yeah. leak called? Uh, That's a free game, right? You free, yeah, free, free, free game. They might like that shit. Like they might like that bro, shit. Like, 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 but but compared, but compared, but compared to what you bro. do, bro, they, they I don't like know. Anything trash, bro. I'm not even. They just don't know bars like that. That's what I'm saying. I'm gonna have a lot of shit that goes over their head. What That's why smoke? I got. Some... What, what you mean, Keith's about to get smoked? He just smoked. Uh... Smoked by who? Raymond smoking keys? Yep. No. Hold on, hold on. Y'all battling? I'm battling Keith in November. Hold on, isn't he battling Dougie though uh, before you? Yeah, he got Dougie yeah, uh, that nigga Dougie next ain't month. Showing up. Hell no, you know. I think, I think, I think he. Hey, I think Vice, he where the dominoes? If we get, if we be in real, I'm on the Dougie. streets of rage real quick. Because right. he was he was supposed to be my original opponent in Arizona before Mister right. White. So I think I think he gonna back out again. Who but, keeps? Uh, yeah, he gonna come up with some type of excuse. Yeah, he gonna come. Up I'm some gonna type I'm gonna back out on you too. But, but Man, we don't have Tom a battle Blake, lined bro. up. They I don't know. Like I trash, say that. bro. That's not street bars. It's trash, bro. They like anything that gets fucking said, bro. They were gassing. I I really and it's Coach illegal. Kids. I didn't want to like. I like I like one of those dudes from Free Game. What's his name? Uh, Justice. Justice, Justice is cool. No, Justice, Justice is fire. fire. Like, I don't yeah, say yeah but he don't say like, like he don't have complex bars like that. Like my shit is complex. I thought with his performance. But I'm saying though, but like his this, bars, but this, this his bars though, aren't bro, next level. Hell, his no. bars ain't. Like, hey, Nico, that's gonna be like a, that. that's gonna be a reason I tell him. Like that's gonna be like I'm gonna have you, Madman, judge. Like, I'm gonna tell him like, bro, nigga, these niggas don't know bars. I need somebody that knows fucking bars to judge the battle, son. Nigga, so, me, nigga, you ain't gonna. I'm telling you, it matters, nigga, who judge the battle, bro? Because you are gonna get a it weirdo who don't know material, and you bro, gonna walk away. Bro, you, like niggas, like bro, there are niggas that walking around that really think the Grizz beat you. Like, bro, did you niggas did you watch the same battle? He tried. No, it's just like niggas don't be, like, especially on the West Coast. And this is, like, even worse because this, this ain't even a real battle. League. This like nigga friends coming to watch people yell at each other. <laughs> you're, bro, you're funny as hell for that. That's like, good, that's dude. really what it is. Niggas don't know I mean, what the fuck these niggas be talking they, about. They, they, they still up and coming, so it's not really a battle rap crowd at all, bro. It's like. Everybody there is just for real, for real. Like, I like that voice crowd, crowd though. Ooh, that cameraman, you. that cameraman kind of kind of fire. No, 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 no. I got, a, I got they, a have the, they, they have the they have the best quality after Alba. They have the best quality and all that. But I'm saying, bro, they the crowd like how Nexus saying there is all homeboys and family. It's not a battle rap crowd. Yeah, like battle oh, rap okay, today is what okay, they see so at that league. That probably they they, they would probably move. gravitate more to that nigga Neff so basic ABC shit then. Yeah, huh? That's what I'm saying. Right. That's what I'm even though that the GZ, bro, they was eating Neff shit up, bro. 
bro but but i think i think next energy alone like it's just it's, it's not gonna look right <laughs> you feel me like standing, well, plus standing i'm about to bring 15 that. niggas with me to the battle so but I mean, but I mean, even with that though, bro, I feel like if they can understand what Justice be doing up there, bro, they'll understand next. They might not understand his intricate shit, but they can understand the simple shit that he said. Yeah. Yeah, yeah but you I might, don't know. You might, you might have to dumb it down bars. a little, but I mean, shit, Justice that nigga four never. Bars. <laughs> Justice be having four bar buildups and long, like, dragged out schemes. That's why they understand it so much. Uh oh, dad duties. Who was that? Faye. Oh. Oh, I thought that was Lil Drake's. Oh. Nah, that Drake, nigga Drake's been on mute. Oh. Drake's hey, no hey, better. Hey, after, after, after that, after uh, my Drake's nigga no Frat got better. robbed, that nigga Drake called me, bro. Who he got robbed? Oh, Frat. That nigga Frat, bro, we must have laughed about it. Like, nigga, we can't believe these niggas pulled this bullshit. Hey, this nigga, hey, Ray May was mad. He knew this nigga was mad. This nigga had on Snapchat venting. I'm like, bro, I'm like, bro, this makes no fucking sense, bro. This, this makes zero sense. I was like, because that shit's really mind but like I, like, I damn near turned the battle off after the second round because I'm like, oh, shit, frack two up. And then I come back and I watch the end of the third and then watch all four of these niggas unanimously pick disaster. Like what? I was so confused, bro. And then I thought I was tripping till I seen the timeline. I'm like, okay. And then I seen the fan vote. And I'm like, all right, I'm not tripping. It's these niggas. I thought you gonna lie. Yeah, yeah. Kato saying round one true? with Ty Diz won that round, bro. Like, I right, man. Hey. I have frag three. Oh, I'm not gonna lie to you. Yeah, yeah I, 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 have, I actually I just frag. watched the battle. Yeah, I have frag all three. Nah, I cut that. That first round was close, but not. First was close. The first was the, the closest round. Close. Hey, I forgot I about it. I gave it to Frack. Hey, who trying to jump uh, Shockwave with me? Let's get out of here. Ooh, me, and just... Faye gonna do a, me and Faye going to do a two-on-two -two round against Shockwave. Don't tell him, though. That's tough. That nigga that said, don't tell him like he ain't listening. Hey, I forgot all about this EK bar. They said even Kobe was a ball hog until he passed. Ugh. That shit was fire. Ugh. Ugh. What do you say that against? I, I don't he said that against glue. Glue easy. Yeah. That's crazy. Uh, that wasn't that more one. fire than at the White Howard bar he had for uh No, my Michael. favorite EK bar is the fucking uh I seen your TV, don't chase, or you could choose which ton of plasma you trying to donate. Oh, that's that's my like, favorite EK oh, bar. That's, that's, that's still one of my favorite battles, bro. Easily. That's cool. I watched that shit. All That's my favorite hard. EK bar, easily. That shit was when I first see that, bro. I said, LA know the oh. difference between Diesel and Dwight Howard. I was like, oh. his whole first for Nightwing was. Hey, I'm, not, I'm, not, I'm not gonna lie to you, bro. One of my favorite bars from EK was when he battled that nigga Jerry West and he did that Reggie Miller shit, bro. He is a fake the choking was like I heard the choking the guard, <laughs> the one that when you on fire in the guard. Hey, like, now what? What my nah, one of the rebuttals he had against Dev was wild too. The coat jacket. jacket too. The coat jacket. Um, I, what, what do you what do you say? Woke, woke brother, you supposed to eat organic, not let organic eat off you. Shoot. Nigga, hold on. <laughs> that shit oh, fire. he said I don't got no gun shit. I'm not gonna lie, bro. If y'all go back to EK when he was at A hat, he got a lot of lines that niggas sleep on. Like he has some. EK fire. versus Jerry West was actually a fire battle. It was. Fire I'm battle. telling you, bro. That like, and I, that's why I always wonder when niggas was like sleeping on Jerry. <clears> I'm like, bro, he was. He been fired for a minute. Yeah, that was a. That was actually that was the first battle I seen from EK was him and uh, Jerry West. That shit was fire. Yeah, go to he some has, EK battles he has before. Shit the first, uh, bro, before but I have that, bro. Go to some of his A hat ones, bro. His A hat shit is fire. Yeah, yeah, that's what I'm saying. I'm actually not too familiar with his uh with his previous like before URL shit. Hey, conflict. I feel like I know who you're talking about that you got a battle. I feel like I know who it is. And if it's who I'm thinking it is, conflict, and if you don't beat this. Hey, who got an event on, on, our, on Halloween? Who else got an event? I don't know. Conflict said he got a battle, though. So it's. it's, it's I don't want to assume it's a hidden league. Hidden league, for sure. That nigga said a hidden league. I mean, okay. It's a lot of hidden leagues out here. They ain't made it yet. The rap league before Christmas? I think, but I think I do know who it is. I have an idea. If, if I'm wrong, I'm wrong. But I feel like I have an idea on who it is. 
This nigga <laughs> not bro. You ain't shit, bro. Shot too, nigga. Oh, 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 oh. I think yeah, who else got an event that day. Yeah, he did. I'm looking at Drake's uh, commentary about Kato. Kato's had me weak when he was breaking down the diz and fracture. Like, he was standing there. What he said, this shit was like, yeah, nigga. Got it, nigga. <laughs> hey, y'all got to hear Vice's uh, conflict uh, impression. That shit is. <laughs> Vice is crazy. Vice got to get that shit off his chest. Nah, you want to know what's crazy? Nigga, I, I was crying. crying. Dead. That and the robot vice shit. Oh my! That's what I'm talking God. about. That's what I'm talking about. Nigga. <laughs> uh, conf conflict. Your style is predictable now. Niggas got niggas got parodies on you now, nigga. nigga no, this nigga vice did it so off the fly, nigga. It was <laughs> bro. You know, I always bodied everybody in my chat. Suggestion. This nigga, uh, this nigga Nico, when he did the Young Grizz impersonation on his YouTube channel. And this nigga actually has a bucket on his head. Oh, <laughs> this nigga. I ain't never seen that. One, bro, and hey, that's crazy. This bro, nigga, hey, bro, this nigga fate went back to the clap. Yo, this is 20. This is me my first started, dude, bro. This is crazy. This nigga fake. That shit popped up with my suggestions, bro. I was dying. This bro, nigga so Nico did, had a whole ass so bucket on his head. Those, I, do. I did. I did. I did, I did hey, look, bro. The, the clutch one I did, niggas was laughing at that shit. I, I did a parody on clutch. Yeah, I, I remember did, that one. I remember that one. Grizz. <laughs> I did a second one on Geechee. I was going to do one on Dre Vicious, but I couldn't find no fucking purple bandana. So I was about to fuck up. I was about to kill him with a fucking bandana. I couldn't find I no can't purple find bandana. It. What's it called? It's called uh, Young Grizz Be Like. Yeah, just type in Grizz Be Like. You know what I'm saying? You'll see it. Oh, Young Grizz Be Like. All right, cool. <laughs> but yeah, see, that's how Grizz bucket. used to rap at that time, so I was fucking him up. Like, Yeah, he, <laughs> he got up. a real bucket on his head. That's hilarious. Tell, that's the worst part, man. That's the most funny part of the whole shit. <laughs> yeah, you got to make it back. A real ass bucket. I ain't going to lie, bro. I feel, <laughs> I feel like doing like a throwback and like uploading some of these videos. But I'm like, bro, I don't know. Like, better have changed so much with these niggas. Like, I don't know. I don't know. The most successful parody I ever had that made it like national was the uh, fast food shit I did for Geechee. Like the Geechee order and fast food one. <laughs> that shit was hilarious. Yeah, I'm probably if I was in the Western Conference, I'd probably bring them back and like repost them and all that. But I ain't in the Western Conference no more. Fuck that group. <laughs> if you on Shots Fired, go peep the new announcement. Shots Fired got a new announcement? Facts, go peep it. Shots Fired Battle League. What'd they say? Bro, he, there ain't no damn announcement, bro. <laughs> Nigga, Ramay sounds crazy. I'm glad these weak-ass Raiders won tonight. Booty. Yeah, man. I've seen that shit, too. Booties, hey, nah, but hey, tap in with me. I'm gonna have the bootlegs of Dot Nikkei. You feel me? Since uh, ain't nobody invited. Oh, yeah, yeah that ain't gonna be no live stream. I'm not, not paying for I, another I, live stream. I, Fuck that. That nigga 65 owes me five dollars. Oh, nigga, nigga, <laughs> hold on, nigga, nigga, <laughs> niggas paying for VOD. Uh, well, K told me that was for sure gonna be a VOD, uh, but uh. He don't know I'm about here. a live stream yet. I'm gonna hit this nigga up in the new wave, in the new Nikkei. wave chat, and I'm gonna press this nigga. Give me my fucking video. I'm not watching. Yeah, these press his, press his line. Hey, that nigga, he must have texted me free. like a week ago. And he was like, "Hey, you're you're invited to the event." I was like, "Nigga, I was gonna come." <laughs> hold on, hold on, hold on. Who's battling on this card before I even think about watching this? Vice show? versa, Max Taylor. That's trash. Soto and Shy Dog. Vice thirty. I don't care about that battle. So I don't so come on, bro. That's a hidden character battle. Next. Dot everything versus EK. Okay, that, that's the that's one. That, that's, that, that's, one. that's the one. Okay, that, that, that's one. Come on, so do one, bro. Like dude, these are a lot of store value battles, bro. It's a lot of store value on that card, bro. I'm not gonna lie to you. It's a lot of store value. I'm battling right May on it. Yeah, I, I felt like if they only had three battles, they should have had more impactful like where's Ray May at Ray May where's this your league well I just heard Ray 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 um, I was supposed to be United, battling United for the belt but um yeah you were supposed to battle <laughs> I was supposed so to got a bigger name okay. ain't no belt no more oh, oh that was conflict <laughs> I thought that was Drix that said that hey, conflict you really wanted to see Soto and shit come on bro seriously conflict come on man what do you want to see one day 
one nigga's finna rap mm-hmm. fast and say a whole bunch of ABC punchlines, and the other nigga finna rap yeah. slow and rapidly rap. Like, what are we doing? <laughs> Changed it up a little bit. I just heard his round. Who? Who's round? Soto's. It's trash still. I don't, all that shit trash. Hey, basically, Drix. That's basically what happened. It's I'm all good. I'm not gonna lie, battle. bro. Kelly Smooth is about to finesse shots fire. He is never battling for that belt again, bro. He ain't released. He ain't. He ain't giving yeah. me all that shit back. Bro. Yeah, he's, he's not. He's not battling like, for the belt. He that didn't that really release that belt, bro. That's just fucked up. Yeah, we all better come to LA and force that nigga to give it up. He ain't giving y'all that belt. He gonna go to every that event with that motherfucker on. He he told me he told me he told me he, he, told me he considered he told me he considered forfeiting it to me, and then he said Coop Deville talked him out of it. I was like, that old hating ass nigga. Coop. Yeah, no, I can hear Coop now. Nah, don't give it to that nigga, right, mate? Nah, I gotta, I gotta <laughs> take more pictures with him. Yeah, yeah, like nigga, gonna, what? Yeah, he, he definitely gonna have to buy another belt, bro. Kyle Smooth not giving that shit up. He didn't even give Hawaii that shit back, nigga. Oh Look. shit! Look, he can't even give it back. Smooth lost the belt. I'd go win the belt, but they gotta buy a better belt, bro. That should be looking plastic. I, I need my shit looking nice. I'm not yeah, wearing that little belt. Champion of the year type. Right, belt. He lost it after the shy dog battle. Yeah, he did. Yeah. Damn, that sucks. Well, shit, nigga, you better go get some duct tape, nigga. Shit. <laughs> Hey, bro, Coop DeVille is like the ultimate hidden character. Like, he really is hidden. Like, <laughs> that nigga, that nigga, that nigga if I ever see him in person, hey, I'm really not going to know who he is. Know, but it's tough. I still yeah, I don't, I don't know what Coop DeVille guard. looks like. I'm not yeah, me neither. If I ever see him, he looks like reptiles. Bro, I think I met him too. No <laughs> hey, you, hey, you know, hey, you know what's crazy, bro? I actually recap one of his battles, and it was so trash. I feel like I had to delete the fucking recap. It was him versus Yodi. Oh, you a hidden character seen, for a I seen that. Cooper I person. I want to say like one time. I only knew he was because his voice. Hold on, what? Oh, show here I, so I, much. oh, that dude, Drix, you trolling? Stop playing. Coop go crazy. Get the fuck out of here, Drix. Now, he, now he sound like smooth, nigga. <laughs> I'm about to, I'm about to call Coop out right now in the Western Conference. I'm not gonna lie, Coop on the hey. show was cool, but the battles he had, he was trash. So like, he wasn't good. Yeah, Coop a cool nigga. You feel me? But yeah. as far as battling. I still think he could be six. Oh, you saying in person? I like to talk about his battles. I was like, serious. oh my god. Nah, I got sixty-five winning, bro. <laughs> Not even go home, dude. Sixty-five they battling? is battling him. Oh, you talking about who's he battling? <laughs> he talking about sixty-five. Right, it's cool. it's a battle, cool. I got cool when he's two battling one. him. I got, I got. No, nah, they're not battling. Nah, I ain't gonna lie. I was getting ready to go in this chat and cut 65 out, bro. I'm serious. Nah, six keep, six keep turning it down, but I think Cooper win 2 1. No. I, I think it is. I think he's gonna have more shock value. They both suck, so it's like, who who going to change? I agree. I, I after after the shit I seen, after what I seen, I, I after seen against uh, gotta... SL500, I don't have no faith in bro. Six is very Yo, terrible. that nigga, I do, nigga got in the car. 20 minutes to go see that nigga lose to a nigga using all pause worthy bars. Shit was vicious. That shit was disgusting. I was mad, nigga. I was like 65. Was I, was mad. I was mad that niggas ain't punch out Jay Vicious. Yeah, that shit. That was Hold another on, situation. Bro. Who? Is that the white boy? That's another yeah. situation. Mexican, where the fuck he is? Okay, shock, 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 boy, shock, boy, shock, boy, shock, boy, shock, boy. Let me just let me because it's public. It's, it's public information, bro. This this that. Hey, I drinks. I was just going there, bro. You can go on my Make channel. It's it's, it's still on my YouTube it's channel. It's still on my YouTube channel. No, I'm, I'm doing talking recaps. about recently. No, 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 no. We don't, we don't, we don't, we don't, we don't, we don't need to go recently because he got marked out on my channel years ago, 2017 in San Diego, bro. Well, that's the th- that's the, the thing. Like he was, when he when he approached. Come on now. I wasn't there for the mega mark out. Well, shit. Well, well, no, that's all, they, that, the, that's all that counts to me because that was my first time meeting a nigga, seeing a nigga, and that's all I seen, bro. I'm trying to do recaps. I turned the camera. I was like, what the fuck am I, I, I watching? I thought niggas was like shit. battling, nah, so I go so over there and look at it. Is this video? That's why I started what? my round versus Mega like that. So when you swung on Justin, that was the only time you punched vicious. Wait, wait, there was a video? Bro, it's on my channel, bro. I recorded it, bro. I was doing a recap. I was doing interviews, right? And I, and I heard somebody sound like battling, and I turned the camera, and this nigga Mega ran up on him and slapped him. I was like, "Oh shit, okay." 
Oh, nigga, let me see that. It's on my channel, bro. You, you I don't know, bro. That. I'm going to be honest. I don't know what it. it's called, bro, but it's on my channel. You're going to have to go back to 2017, bro. It's on there, though. Hey, hey I'm on the way. <laughs> hey, hey, I don't know what that shit's called, though. I couldn't even tell you, honestly. Matter of fact, let me I'm, not laugh. Laugh. I'm telling you, you're gonna be upset. That was uh, that was that should have been casual conflicts versus uh, from the gate. Hey, sure. Casual conflicts is giving out money. I'm trying to get that back. Yo, hey, but now <laughs> from my understanding, that night the reason that the reason that niggas wasn't on that kind of time was because of how Jay approached. Like everybody, like oh, he was on some like apologetic shit, you know, because he didn't. He got, always on. Like, he talked tough on on the internet, and yeah, then when niggas pressed him, when, when, when he got in front of niggas, he was apologizing. You feel me? Like I didn't, I didn't exactly. see the initial altercation, but when I seen him, he was apologizing to everyone. So and it's like, tough okay. though because niggas told me a different story. So back then, I was rocking with Jack, so I was uh, about to beat yeah. up Mega. No, bro. Listen, when I when I when I first started battling, bro, that nigga called me, bro, and he was talking mad shit about Ken Griff, nigga, like mad shit, trying to get me to battle over there. And just some told me, like, nah, I don't believe what this nigga saying. Yeah, bro. I'm so like, he, he really the reason CRS had a bad rep before we even started shit, bro. Hey, who remembers what that event <laughs> that shots fired was called when Gotti battled Mad Flex? What was that shit called? Uh, S. Differante. Right. I was supposed to battle Rayman on that card. Hey, Nico, you got, uh, you got you got two YouTube pages? Mm, no, that's under Nico TV. Type in, um, oh, type in, type in, it might be, type in West Coast Battle Media. You, it might find it under that. I definitely had the video. I don't know. I might have took it down. I don't know. I can't remember. It's long, but I definitely had the video of him getting slapped. He definitely got slapped. That's tough. Yeah, I need that. Lad. Nah, bro, I've been trying to... Communicate yeah, bro, that, that's, why, that's, why yeah, that's why when a nigga was talking, he was trying to squeeze his way back into shit. He was talking about yeah. bias and you. I you, told you him, next time I see him, I'm gonna smack the shit out of him. I ain't got shit to say to him, bro. But shock the way the way I feel about it, I feel like people fuck with me, Sherry. You feel me? Yo, and people... this nigga, hey yo, this nigga conflict is sick, bro. Yeah, he does that. People, that's people that's definitely fuck with me, Sherry. But I had to separate from Sherry too, like oh for real, like damn, I thought Miss Sherry was a nice lady. No, I mean, no, she cool, but my thing is she don't know how to run a battle league. So, literally, I'm doing everything behind the scenes. I'm not about to sit here and oh, do all yeah, the footwork. I can see like, that for sure, for sure. Yeah, so I told her I got to chill, bro. You like, was running the door the last of me. Exactly, nigga. Run the door, book the battles, get the car, get the flyer, pay keys. Like, no, nigga. I don't have time for all that shit. Yeah, and you had to battle that night, too. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> you had to battle that night, too. That shit was funny. And it's like certain people that was cool in the corner. She's like, no, so and so said that was talking about man. If you don't knock it off, so that's why they had to sink or swim on this last card, and shit didn't happen. Devon and uh, Smurf. Yeah, you feel me? I'm waiting for that. You feel me? I see these niggas going back and forth all the time. Motherfuckers, cousins, motherfuckers, family members, all talking on Facebook about it. I'm like, man, I'm trying to see this shit. You, you see what happened when when the shock don't orchestrate the card? Oh, it's right it's here. Good. I found it. I got you, Shock Boy. I found it, nigga. <laughs> drop it in the I chat. Put, drop, drop it in the chat. Drop that in here. Drop it in the chat. I I'm found that, that shit. Here. Hey, I had to type in the little S difference. I found it. But now nah, the title was you titled this one because I didn't want to put the name out there. But I might change the title on this one to Mega One Slaps fucking J. What's his name? Let me retitle this real quick. What's Jay your name? Mega yeah. One Slap is J. Vicious. Vicious. Like uh, J. Let me, let me, let me, let me change the title so niggas can know what they looking for, man. <laughs> yeah, nah, but hey, like, Jay Shockwave, when I tell you, I ain't never seen a nigga that apologetic in my life. Like, he was like, yeah, man, he was like, I, I, I lost everything, da, 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 and he's just going on and on. I'm just looking at him like, bro, you sound pitiful, all that shit you was yeah. talking to him. Yeah, like, look, so his sister, it is tough, like, if I was, he don't want the rematch because I got so much dirt on that nigga. That was my first bro, battle his ever. own battlers was battling him and airing him out. That shit was nasty. Bro, Brendan did that nigga so dirty. Like, bro, like, like niggas out here know about that shit, bro, but, like, the conference doesn't know, bro. His battlers, bro, was battling him and just airing all his dirty laundry out. That shit was funny, nigga. And what? <laughs> what was the thing? <laughs> 
I got you. I'm about to post that shit right now. Yeah, drop that shit. Man. That nigga, hey, nigga was, man, was man. talking to that nigga. Nah, they nice. was just talking about how he how he be jerking hey, promoting. He was, he, hey, yeah, he like was, he, he bro, moved real so feminine he, and he pretty wanna, much, don't ever want to take the blame for shit. So yeah, and, then, and then he yo, he was hey, like trapping his sidebar, battlers, sidebar, right? He's like he would only want his battlers to battle for him. If niggas go back, yeah, like you gotta do this. Like he was blocking. Like Brendan had three battle of the days he could have did, or in a GZ. And they all got blocked. There you go. Cause Jay. Nigga. Hey, bro. I'm telling bro, I got so much content on my fucking channel, bro. Like, nigga, I got classics on there, bro. Honestly. West Coast classes. I won't say no national class. West Coast class. I got West Coast classes. Everybody got quiet. Everybody went to go on West Oh, my Coast. God, bro. I cannot believe I just watched this again. I don't know. He, I see, the way niggas put it, I thought he dropped, bro. Make him want to fight for real. Look at him. Are y'all serious? Like, he swung and stepped back. That's a nigga that don't want to fight. Oh, look. So, this shit happened. The next morning, this nigga Jay was like, bro, blah, 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 blah. They tried to jump me. Da, da, da. So, I'm sitting here. I, mean, I know where Mega Stay at. Mega Stay at PB. So, I was about to pull up the Mega yeah, House. I done been and make somebody carried the day go. Next time I carried the day go. And then I heard the real story. I'm like, nigga, you need to handle that yourself. That was a one on one. You sound like a bitch. And then when I battled Philip 413, he tried to bring the shit up. Well, where was you at when the first off, nigga, I wasn't there that night. The fuck? Niggas always out here, bro. Niggas always try to dumb shit when Shockwave isn't around. It's hella funny. Oh God, I swear. Like even <laughs> that nigga, the that nigga shit, there, I'm the like, nigga. he's not there. Niggas is doing all sorts of outlandish shit. That shit is hilarious, bro. That nigga mega well, punch Cake to... Bill. No, nah, I, don't, I, don't, I, don't, I, don't, I don't even. I don't even think he landed contact on none of them niggas. I keep watching and rewinding. It's just hilarious. It's, it's not right. even a it's, punch. It's, it's, it's funny for all parties involved, but like that wasn't a good. Bro, I got a Crown Vic interview. Damn, that's crazy. Crown Vic, ain't that ain't that the nigga like when Geechee first started coming around, he was coming with that nigga? Yeah, that's Geechee. That's, that's, that's the only reason that Look at the hidden characters I have interviewed, bro. Radio? Look at the. Yeah, y'all can't never tell me I ain't never uh, did shit for the West, bro. I done put on for you niggas for damn four years. Nah, nigga. You, 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 you have me on the show. Bro, look at the uh, look at the caliber of nigga I have given coverage to. You niggas better not ever tell me I ain't did nothing for you. The caliber of nigga I give coverage to. Bro, look at this shit, bro. Right, hey, man. Why aren't you coming on your new announcement, bro? That shit's fake. I'm not battling you no more. <laughs> I'm over here, so I don't get bro, I, bro, I, bro, I inter bro, I interviewed this nigga Floss when he was nobody out here, bro. This is crazy. When? Hey, I ain't gonna lie. Nigga, I wanted to I see said, the shots first fired event. This uh, what was that? we call it? The Ray May S different nigga, whatever the fuck it was called. This nigga, this is like S four years ago, bro. I got nigga, to, uh, Reaper Rail be drunk, bro. What the fuck is wrong with Reaper? Bro, can you no stop stop responding to him, bro? I yeah, bro. Seen, I even told me the other Look, day because I Rail is a very Rail. emotional nigga, like nah, bro. No, no, no. He up he until the Nightwing battle, this nigga had me blocked for like four years. Nah, he a weirdo. We not, we not, we're not doing that, bro. He, I, I seen the little shit that he sent to me and he put on Twitter, bro. I'm not respond. That nigga didn't get no fucking responses, bro. Like I'm looking at the shit, like, bro, ain't nobody even responding to this, bro. It's not even exciting to the niggas who like drama, bro. You're a weirdo. Don't nobody take you serious. Yeah, bro. How I, many, bro? Bro, how, bro this... how many of y'all was in the Western Conference group back before he battled Stewie Newton? That nigga Reaper Rail was talking. I mean, he was talking amazing shit. I'm talking about it. Sounded great. He got out here to battle Stewie on his best fucking behavior. We didn't see none of that extracurricular, none of that. None of that energy came out here. So I don't just rap, bro. We don't, you don't need to be doing all that. Because when you had the time to do something after talking greasy, you didn't do shit. So just, just rap. He I don't, I don't take you to, I'm not going to respond to you, bro. Like, nah, talk you, to that nigga, Nico. It, bro, it's not even talking to him. It's just real, bro. Like, if you're in a situation where you talk crazy and then you come to an event and don't do shit, stop talking. Like, just rap. Like, we all here for rap, bro. Ain't nobody here to be 
fucking banging in the street. We ain't doing all that shit on no fucking battle rap. What the fuck? I had a rap event, bro. What the fuck I look like, nigga? We here for fucking rap. Man, I'm mad as fuck. I'm about to write this whole third round tomorrow because I'm not going to get my Xbox pre-ordered. He, he is my ass, bro. He's not good, bro. Like... And he did have a he did have a good bar versus Stewie in his first one. I remember this shit, little Stewie shit. Nah, he had the stew, stew, stew shit. That's that shit was fire. That was fire. That's, was fire. Hey, That's the only shit he had. That was what? Stewie smoked him. You still, you still trying to do that Gain of Angels remix, nigga? Because I can send you the open verse. Yeah, send it to me. Yeah, yeah I got some shit, man. I got some shit waiting to drop, bro. It's... Yeah, bro. I, I was talking to my engineer today. I got a couple songs coming in soon. I'm going to drop January. That's fire. I'm trying to, I'm trying to drop mine like November, December. Yeah. All right, man. I'm trying to think, do I got any other fades on my channel? Because I feel like, I feel like niggas have gotten in front of me when I was like recording somebody else and like tried to start something because they knew that it was on camera. I feel like there's been another one that had popped up. Nah, bro, nothing. Hey, have y'all, have y'all ever seen that video where it's, uh, it's the 65 and, uh, G play fight, but it's the the voiceovers, nigga. That shit is so. Yeah, I think so. Shit. And uh, I'm still mad. I'm mad as fuck at KO for having that <laughs> phone. Like that. Why you record that on a Motorola sliver? Like nigga. Nah, that nigga. Bro, my nigga KO. Lie, bro. I, I do. I do need them videos, bro. Cause them is classic videos, bro. Like I need the classics just just to have them on standby in case niggas. You know what I'm I was so mad when I seen that shit too. It was funny though. It, but to me, bro, I didn't even look at that like it was supposed to be like a real like. Fade. It was more just entertainment for niggas, bro. Cause it was a battle rap fucking issue anyway. It wasn't even no real personal. It was battle rap. Like, nah, exactly. was, was well, so did any did anybody horrible. see when uh when George Burns uh socked up Epic? I was standing right. No, next I didn't see that. I was standing I, right. I was, I was standing there, right next nigga. to Epic, and I couldn't believe that that nigga hey. did not retaliate, bro. I've never did seen nothing. A man get he did hit nothing. That, nigga, and not that shit was so funny. He he and he literally, bro, you can see George Burns walking up on this nigga. I'm hey. looking at Burns like, oh, he hey, walking he, up to hit somebody. He, he ain't say what's up to nobody. He ain't shake no hands. He just said, what's up? Beep, beep, beep. And fuck that boy. <laughs> bro, he really Ooh. fired on him, bro. That shit was so funny, bro. Like like, like the definition of on site, nigga. Like, and I bro, can't and, just and we, and bro, we're all sitting there talking shit. Like, this, you know, this is right before I'm about to battle 65. 65, they're talking shit to him. I'm talking shit to him. All the niggas over there, all the bangers, they was all talking shit. Like, bro, you're not going to fire on them? You're not going to uh, get us? He's like, oh, I don't want to get jumped. Like, nigga, we ain't going to let you get jumped. Get your get like, back. Like, right like, there. Hey, that, hey, then he stayed at the event. <laughs> the whole time, bro. That shit was so funny, dog. Who? Epic. <laughs> Who fired on him? The nigga George Burns. Well, you know, I thought those were the Asian same dude? people. I'm not going to lie to you. Well, you know. Well, Epic, the little... Little Asian side, dude? You, know, you know the little uh, little I evolved nigga, the mess, that Mexican dude. I know him, but I thought that was George Burns. Who's George nah, Burns? George, George Burns is the he the other uh, Mexican dude. He like the he the uh, the P O K dude, right? He, the yeah, owner, right? Yeah, the P O K nigga. Right. Little But yeah, he he ran up on him, bro. Fired on him, and I'm expecting a fade. And the nigga Epic just was nodding his head, like, okay, yeah. Right. You got that? You got that? <laughs> No, I definitely don't have that. I, bro, I didn't bring my camera to that event, bro. I, I was, I'm going to be honest, bro. Like, that's what you I, said when I, I got fired, 60, I bro, hate I, niggas like that. Nigga, I bet 65, nigga, career. Like, nigga, if I would have lost to 65, I wouldn't even be here right now, bro. I was all the way prepared to not do no more media shit, bro. I was prepared. I ain't bring no camera, no nothing. Nothing. Six ain't been the same ever since. That's, a, that's tough. That is. That nigga, is Vice tough. ducking and Domino smoke, bro. Didn't Vice say he was playing Streets of Rage or some shit? Yeah. I don't know what that is. What? Like the day before your time, youngin. Yeah, I'm, I'm like, what? Yeah, I, oh, I had to remember how old this nigga next is. Yeah, you yeah, remember he just turned 12 yesterday. <laughs> 12 and a half, nigga. <laughs> 12 and a half, didn't get it right. I really do be forgetting how old this nigga next is, bro, because he been around in battle rap so long. I be thinking niggas have been around five, exactly. six years as like he carried 25, himself different. 30 he don't, he don't carry himself like, like a young nigga. Yeah. Like we was on we was on the, uh, the little sparring conference call and, and Soto was calling him big bro. Like he don't carry himself like a young nigga at all. Yeah. Man. Hey, y'all see this picture of of uh, conflict at the crucible, 
Hey, conflict, fight back, bro. Where are you at, nigga? You got to fight back, nigga. <laughs> I just made that shit. He, he, said, he, he said conflict got the work boots on at the fucking crucible. Made Yo, that shit. That, that shit was, was conflict? Hilarious. That was conflict. Yo, conflict, you got to fight back, my nigga. I got, you got to get queued up or something. You got to fight back off of that, bro. What happened? <laughs> But that, hey, I ain't gonna lie, that is crazy. You did wear some fucking boots to fucking free game too, though. That's crazy, bro. And boots. Damn, that's fucking crazy, bro. Then let me save this just in case. I, I need five. Look at the white boots. Look at the white boots. Yeah, I got, I got, I got to save that file. So I ain't in the Western Conference no more. So I ain't gonna see none of this shit. Hey, boy, you keep leaving the conference. But I'll be, but I be getting to a point where I get tired of seeing weird shit in the conference, bro. Like niggas just be like, there ain't nothing really. It was nothing really popping in there, bro. Like it's a bunch of niggas just talking shit. There wasn't no battles. Yeah, like, if it ain't, then the yeah, battles that was coming out wasn't even niggas good. Niggas fight. Like, bro, I could, like, it just to me, it just got like, come on, bro. Like, I understand the nigga tree, but it's like y'all not like the battles drop. The battles ain't good. Like it just. Uh, I don't know, bro. I'll be on Twitter. I'm, 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 I'm trying to get that Twitter. I'm trying to I'm trying to get that next thousand. I just eclipsed a thousand subs. I'm trying to get two thousand before the year up. So I'm trying to get that shit popping. And Twitter is like the where all battle rap is at. So I'm trying to maximize my fucking potential. I'm trying to get to two thousand subs this year. I'm trying to that shit crack. I feel it. I I mean, it, listen. If a nigga, if a nigga in, uh, add me back or some, I, I I might consider the group, but I don't I don't know. I don't know about that damn group. I don't know, man. This nigga said Ledger, but why are you tagging a nigga who not on here? This nigga? I just seen that nigga on Twitter talking crazy to my nigga Nico, so I'd let him know that he was a bum. <laughs> oh yeah, nah, he was. He yeah, leave my bro Ledge alone. Nah, cause man. he, nah, cause he, nah, cause he, be, yo, cause he hit me up at the beginning of every week. Like, I can't wait till Friday. I'm gonna smoke you. I'm like, bro, you're gonna get killed again, bro. I be cooking you. Really, dude, though, this is your show at this point. But I ain't gonna lie, though. But I ain't gonna lie, though, bro. All the people in there, they fuck with Ledge. That's Ledge. That's his supporters. So they be saying I'm losing. I'm like, bro, how y'all got me losing? I be cooking. You said, damn, we gonna make you switch your boots. Why haven't you switched them yet? Yourself. Why we gotta make you do it? <laughs> Why we gotta make you do it? Just say <laughs> wrong footage to come out, man. Niggas playing. Those is lucky boots. Yeah, man. Conflict, you gotta fight hey, so back. I, bro. Hey, next, out of all your battles is out right now, what's your favorite one? My performance or my favorite battle? Favorite, your favorite performance? I don't know. Like, my best shit has not even came out yet. Like, like my best shit was probably the re-up snub battle, lost footage. Then it's probably the, the fucking, what's that shit called? The Crucible ain't came out yet. Then it's probably the j Rome shit. Actually, the j Rome probably better than Crucible. j Rome ain't came out yet. Um, My sick rounds were... Better than anything that was out. Shit ain't happen. But right now, my probably my favorite shit is probably I don't know. Probably the Dallas shit. Me versus Poppy G. Oh, okay. I just think because that's like the most recent. Like that's me when I when I know what what I'm doing. You know, like me and my best. Nah, conflict actually is fire. He is fire. But nah, I, I ain't gonna lie, bro. I like even shit. even the even the rubber tongue shit. I like I ain't gonna lie, bro. I like your Grizz shit better than all that shit just because you show. Oh yeah, I forgot about Grizz. Yeah, I forgot about Grizz. Grizz, Grizz is cool was, too. I like the Ron Compton body. That shit was yeah. man. See the Ron can like the Ron Compton shit. See that shit like I wish that would have dropped on guy, URL. Like, you can't fuck with me. No, I really <laughs> wish that would have dropped on URL. Like it, it, it like the fact it dropped. I didn't like. Uh, that, still, that, that, I still don't that, know why. That, that, that second drop. round, that second <laughs> round was something different, like, bro, it was disgusting. Like niggas was literally like, bro, in the building it was so awkward because niggas did not want me to be wrong at all. Like niggas did not want me to be wrong. So when it happened in the building, it was just awkward as shit. Yes. Niggas tried to blame it. Niggas tried to blame it on the audio. And then the battle dropped and there was nothing wrong with the audio. I was like, what the fuck? How was it the audio? Ain't shit wrong with it. 
Yeah, he just got his ass kicked. The funniest, that, bro, the funniest shit in that battle was when you was talking about the uh, the coffee shit, and coffee was like, she wanted to react, she wanted to like push you, and then she like, oh yeah, I've seen that shit. <laughs> she like, oh, halfway yeah. got there, was like, uh, she like, <laughs> you don't go fuck around and eat her, that shit was fine. Yeah, shit, yeah coffee, just... coffee told me outside too, she was like, bro, that shit was disgusting. That shit was nasty. I told coffee to stand behind me, she almost did. I said, bro, if she would have stood behind me, it would have been ugly, it would have been over. Yeah, that, that was one of them rounds, bro. I ain't gonna lie. That was one of them ones. She was nasty. But no, I like your grid shit. That's your most well-rounded battle, honestly, to me. Like, I like you the well-rounded so, shit. I don't know. I think, I think that probably is where I show the most. But, like, even that, like, I don't know. That's nothing compared to what I've been doing, bro. Like, that shit is cool. Like, I don't know. I think that's why it is because y'all niggas ain't really seen, like, my most recent shit, you know, like I know what what I got in the tuck. So when when I see the grid shit, it's like, oh, that's cool. I like the Poppy G shit. I'm not gonna lie to y'all. I feel like my performance in the Poppy G shit was like scary. Like anybody that stands in front of that type of performance, maybe not the bars, maybe not the angles, but like the performance wise of the Poppy G shit, that that's like my favorite shit. I, I felt like I was floating. What he said? Because a dull blade is fucking pointless. Yeah, yeah. He had, he, it was well rounded, bro. He had, he had some of everything in that Drix, in that, in that Grizz one. That shit was crazy. Where am so I, I from? The, the top Grizz. drawer. I'm with all the extra shit, bro. <laughs> bro, come on, that nigga. shit was disgusting. That shit was just even the only fan shit right after. Like I had mm -hmm. bombs in that shit. Yeah, his poppy yeah, the poppy. Yeah, the Poppy G shit out. It's one round, and I started with like five freestyles, like four or five freestyles. Niggas was like, you got an actual round? <laughs> Talk that frack off of shit, uh, ref. Talk that shit. Yeah, that's fire. Fire. I'm not gonna lie. Frack, frack, was, frack was fire in this shit, bro. But I like Frack versus Excel when he was talking to that and told, called that nigga a team homie intern. But that shit was fucking hilarious, dog. Frack always fire, bro. I, ain't, I mean, I always yeah. seen him. I seen him and Briggs, him and XL, and him and Diz, and all them shits is fired to me. I'm not yeah. gonna lie. That's a fact. So yeah, he's fired. Yeah, I fuck with Frack. Ain't no demon going to King of the Dot, man. Y'all gonna go over there, man. Yeah, yeah. yeah don't act like you're not gonna go over there, bro. I'm so, going everywhere. Nah, Raymay, you see, Raymay, you 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 young, but you're not stubborn like these. These niggas stubborn. These demons are stubborn, nigga. Fate, Drix, nigga, they stubborn demons, man. That's why they. Did. I'm glad he didn't say Dev. Fate well, battled on King of the Dot, but not. But that shit wasn't King of the Dot, bro. That shit was. Well, I, I don't even gotta mention. Is Dev battle rapping right? Like, what is Dev doing? Dev that nigga, Dev got. Yeah, what is Dev, Dev doing right now? Currently, up. I think he's playing two guys. That nigga, <laughs> that, that nigga Dev got some good. shit coming out. Yeah, yeah, look, 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 look at that. 2K, right niggas don't even be on Warzone. Niggas got rid of Warzone six months ago. You nigga, I've been on Warzone all day. Shut up, Nico. I want to hear that shit. You're lying. Shockwave, you be lying, nigga. I be, uh, you ain't niggas don't even be on there, nigga. Nigga, I got clips. I've literally hey. been on Warzone all day today, except for when I play Vice and Max. Yeah, nigga, Nico KD is like a point four. As soon as this nigga next PlayStation, as soon as nigga next PlayStation, Died. All you niggas stop playing the shit, nigga. That shit still ain't no, working. Nigga, bro. I tried all... everything to fix that shit. Nah, that shit's I'm telling you, nah, probably, I, I stopped that's playing. Like, man. only time I stopped playing my Xbox is when I got like crazy days back to back for work. Other than that, I'll be on this bitch every day. We used to go up on Warzone, though. No cap, niggas used to. Be oh on god, that except shit. for when fucking uh, fix fix is I. Fig, hey, Fix is fucking trash in 2K. No, somebody was trash in Warzone. I'm trying to remember who the fuck it was. I don't that know. might be a real name, brother. Hey, listen, I, think I, be, I be Fix. Damn, damn just just played too cost. I think it might have been a real name, I brother. Hate play with, I hate I hate when Dev is the last one alive. Like, oh, bro, God. That shit is just... Niggas might as well restart the game. <laughs> I think... It's that nigga... Uh, Nigga, that nigga, hide behind that nigga the, trash in Warzone, bro. Oh yeah, I think he stopped playing with us after his like first game playing. But and uh, then uh, all the PlayStation niggas started vibing. I'm not playing with you niggas by yourselves. Your headset set. Don't lie, Faith's pretty weak at Warzone too. But me and my nigga Faye got a W, so that that makes up for it. 
Hey. Boom, pretty nice. I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, Boom, nice except for when he get on the phone. Yeah, that nigga be cupcaking. Yeah, Boom, hop on the phone, bro, and wander the fuck off and be mad that you ain't gonna pick him up. Like, nigga, you over here arguing with your baby mama? I ain't got time for this. I be missing wars on, bro. We, dude, niggas was really on that shit, especially when Nico and Boom start getting into it. That should be hilarious. Bro, that shit. Nah, I was silly. playing. Uh, bro, I was playing I GTA. Lie, bro, I used to really hate that shit, bro. I'd be like, nah, <laughs> here we go with it, because you already know what's gonna happen. You can be as logical as you want to, uh, and it's uh, gonna be a response of the year, bro. Like, oh, let me stop. I ain't gonna do it. Nah, I was uh, I played uh, GTA with uh, my nigga Dutch the other day on caffeine. That shit was fun. Uh, GTA. God damn! I I just looked at my chimp, bro. I got so many hidden. I don't know. That shit used to be so funny, bro. My chimp, my, bro. I was dead when 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 Nico and them used to get into it, cause them niggas was real like mad. Like you could tell by the way they talking. Like these niggas is mad right now. I just be instigating that shit. Like that. You talk to a nigga and you using shit like <laughs> logic. And a motherfucker come back at you with like a pen. I'm like, bro, I'm using logic, bro. And he just come back at you with like some out of left field. I'm like, bro, come on. Funny shit. I hate that shit. Jump dab, bro. Jump dab used to really get mad.